first. Oh my gosh, I love how you did that. Let's take it all the way back to 2013. It wasn't that long ago. I'm not trying to make you feel Feels like a long time ago. 11 years. It wasn't that long ago uh, when this guy, Luke Hancock, was the most outstanding player in this year tournament. So he not only knows how to play in this yeah, tournament, but he also guy, knows how to win. So I'm going to take you behind the curtain, right? What exactly is it like for a player getting ready to play in this national championship game? Well, I'll tell you this. I heard Jay Will say this earlier about all this pageantry is great and everything. Let's get this over with. Let's move to the game. And as a player, that's exactly how you're feeling. All the media attention, all the pressure, it just kind of builds and builds and builds. And by the time you get to this point in the season, you're just ready to throw the ball out there. I got to tell you, it's exhausting for a player. It's just so constant and like I said it kind of every round every game it just builds and builds so when you get to this point I'll tell you I was actually worn out getting to the uh, final that four guy. hey that's the big beard too that was young Luke but uh, <laughs> when I got to the final four I was so worn out with just the uh, everything that surrounds all this I'd never had a five-hour energy before this would be uh -huh. good NIL play if that was around when I was there but yeah I drank half a five-hour energy before the Final Four game just to get myself going because it's a long season and kind of worn out. I drank the other half before the national championship. I just want to mention the fact that, you, first of all, the beard, it was thick. We, what happened? Well, you, you know, <laughs> it's, it's not quite the Red Sox, but we, okay. we were going to keep it going until we lost. And oh. then uh, we actually did a shave for life. It was uh, uh, to raise money for cancer okay. uh, after the season when we cut them off. So it was, uh, it was a thing our team did. And even Coach P tried to grow it, but... I got to say his beard looked terrible. So okay, it so off. it was for a good reason, but I feel like it looks so good. You should do that again. Thank you. Yeah, for sure. Uh, Five-hour energy, that is the key to winning the national championship, apparently, according to Luke Hancock, Reese. <laughs> Christine Luke, to that point, Matt Painter said yesterday, they're really not doing any extra practices. They aren't going other places to work the guys out. Wants to keep them fresh for these matchups that will be key tonight that we will break down when we continue in the final moments of college game day, national championship game. The coverage comes up at the top of the hour tip off about 40 minutes away as you look at Fletcher lawyer who's been shooting the ball well from behind the arc and Purdue will need him to do that tonight. Meet Ron. Ron eats, sleeps and breathes hoops. Us? Not us. And there's not a no look pass, double double or buzzer beater he won't wax poetic on ad nauseum. But oh, how he can nail a software solution like the best high screen pick and roll you've ever seen. You need Ron. Ron needs a retirement plan. Work with Principal so we can help you help Ron with a retirement and benefits plan that's right for him. Let our expertise round out yours. Tax Act wants to remind you taxes are due soon. But hey, once you're done, you don't have to think about taxes ever again. Until next year. And every year after that for the rest of your life. Tax Act. Let's get them over with. When we say it'll be on time, they expect it to be on time. Turn shipping to your advantage. Keep those expectations with reliable ground shipping. Thanks, Brandon. With USPS Ground Advantage. Give me that gooey, gooey, crispy, crunchy, mouth watering. Give me that creamy, dreamy, meaty, topping, pepperoni, popping. Give me that crispy, Kobe, only Papa John. Better get you some. Try the trio before it's gone. Hi, guys. Bill, you look great. Let's go. Inspire, I'm free from struggling with the mask and the hose. Fire? It's getting started soon. A treatment that works inside my body with a click of this button. Where are you going? I'm going to get inspired. Learn more and view important safety information at inspiresleep.com. When you're traveling with three kids and pretty much everything they own. Hi, guys. Welcome. It matters where you stay. Hilton for the UC stay. North Carolina is Tip off starting soon. Started uh, 15 minutes. They were 100 apps, each with their, their own greedy little text boxes. And over the last Except Pam. Four years, because Pam uses Grammarly's AI to write in a few places, number 14 not a few and number 15 seeds. And they didn't make a point in round, And that's all you have to show for it at Kentucky. They were saying it's unacceptable, and there was rumblings about Calipari. So it does. Purdue versus UConn. That he's running away. College finals. Something rather than be pushed out, even though they weren't going to push him out because they would have owed him a thirty-three million dollar buyout. But in the end, it's still found. I found myself shot, Jay, Shannon, because check, 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 getting started. To Arkansas. That's not about a better opportunity. Padres Dodgers Sunday at seven on ESPN. 
Stop overpaying for sunglasses. Meet Shady Rays. Shady Rays is high-quality frames and polarized optics for less than half the cost of the big name brands. With lost and broken protection. Plus, we offer free shipping and free returns so that you can try them out with no strings attached. Whoa. Now's the time for a new Honda. Save thousands with 2.9% financing or drive from $239 a month. Full Honda inventory is here. Cars, SUVs, trucks, vans are all in stock. Drive KBB.com's best value brand now. Choose your new Honda with payments from $239 a month or 2.9% financing. The time for a new Honda is here when you search your local Honda dealer today. What do you make of this, Paul? Find out. Oh. Really, amazingly, I think I both fan bases are happy this morning. You say, well, how could that be? Cal is, is a legend. Well, he's a legend who had really played out at the University of Kentucky. This is college game day, covered by State Farm. He got knocked out by Oakland a couple of weeks ago. That was the second time in three seasons he lost in the Guys are warming up, warming up. And Glendale, the Huskies are on the fourth of two are the Boilermakers. There is Zach E. Zach E. is seven foot Four, player to do it multiple years. Seven foot four is out of control. And our good friend Eric, Bill Walton, who in UConn for a national championship two, two last night. UConn team walked in to a fine diamond. Snowman checking in. Team dinner, they get and they were serenaded along. This game's going to get wild. Good chance to boil her up. But boiler up, when you give him boiler a up. To reach Elsky dogs, how you doing? Welcome to the watch party. A lot of people are coming to today. It's going to be a big time game. To start well, maybe it's about seven foot four, four though. I mean, how do you lose with a guy that's seven no foot four? It's out of position. Tip off is going to be great. First time, subscribe to the channel. You'll hear this. When you subscribe, you'll see the live count go up. And I will double check that. Final four for the first time in history. The only issue, he just got a new contract from Greg Byrne, the athletic director, and Greg Byrne put a twenty million dollar buyout. Now you say that is enormous. How could you possibly pay 20? It's going to get Think really interesting today. Welcome to the live. Expecting a lot of people today for the finals, college game, live play-by-play -play through the entire game, even through end of quarter, halftime. Lots of cool things going on, and you can even check this out. We have some cool giveaways and fun things like we did yesterday as well. Take a look at our tournament recap brought to you by Tax Act. You got the Huskies there, Snowman on repeat mode. Okay. Let me put in here actually a little poll so people can actually click on it. What when trucks are what you do to start a poll. You do truck month better than anyone else. You win by breaking every rule or truck should be. Get ready to look at the Trucks are what we do. You can. Sean, what's your immediate reaction to this major, major news? Bang. In the chat. I think it's based on what we heard and what we saw going over the last couple of days. It should line up right there. Pick who you got. Mike, what's up, buddy? Welcome to the live. We're expecting a big time game today again. After Mike jumping into the live here. To me, this is a shocking how the hell are you guys doing pick your team purdue or uconn as it gets started don't wait until after the first quarter people would like to do that they're gonna wait till the first quarter then pick your team pick right now as we get started into the live play-by-play I think a lot of it, KP, has to do with the fact that uh, the, the lack of tournament success in the last couple of seasons. That's great. The big right there we go. Right the the and, and Let's get the watch party big time today. We don't got time to mess around. Let people get in here and stay in here. And as you come in, subscribe. Appreciate subscribing to the channel. The live ticker. Sometimes it goes up and sometimes it got to be fresh. But we can keep checking on it as people subscribe to the channel. I thank everybody for coming in. It's going to be a lot of fun today. There's like a lot of people in here. What we got going on? Who you guys got? Let's go. Let's go. Hey, Mike, you like that new that new uh, little anthem we got for people coming in? 
Again, and when it gets left. rowdy right, right here, check it out. He knows that he can really get it done. And I'll soon get a fresh start in a new program. Uh, my benefit bowl program. Flustered or you get anxious or you are worried. <laughs> I There was a high proclivity for me to look to Shane Battier. Because Shane Battier, when we won a championship. Shane Battier, we're going back to Shane Battier right now. Two years prior. And he always else. seemed cool, calm, and collected. We are getting, getting ready to get started. It is going to be a good time. Right? Somebody like that is a Cam Spencer. Purdue Trucks versus Castle. UConn. And yes, the they have the their center. center. <laughs> and I got a quick shot of him on here. I mean, this dude is seven foot four. Seven foot four. You know how big that is? I can pull up on the screen right now and you can see what he actually looks like. Look at this guy. Let me pull him up on the screen. Look how this guy looks. How can you guard this guy seven foot tall, man? Like, this is going to be interesting watching this guy, right? I just got to say, man. Appreciate you subscribing to the platform as we get ready to get started. A very good NBA coach. Uh, he, has a, he has a team that uh, he is comfortable and confident that he can make right now, and knock them the down. Standing, he is the key for Purdue tonight be, because I have you know, no this question be about what Zach Keady's going to do underneath. Desires. It would be someone of that. Coach is doing that because the size of the guard. Because Braden Smith is smaller. We're getting started early before the game, obviously. To get started. To the next level they face. You go against guys like Tristan Neal, who are 6'5", for the watch party. I agree, but the thing is, they can play off of them. They're going to apply pressure, but also play off of them. Kentucky is going to look big. They're going to go very big. Bang! Appreciate you guys coming into the live. We're getting ready to get started and kick off the game. With the live play by play. We got some cool things today, too. We actually have our live stream bonus and giveaways today, too, if you're in right now. Look at this. Here we are in the goals. Hit over 100 likes. There's going to be a $100 giveaway, over 100 people in the live Xbox giveaway. Uh, $50 super chat. Uh, we get, I uh, take a shot. That's going to go to Mike again. Uh, again, 1,000 subscribers. Give a $1,000 giveaway. $100 sub super chat. Bong a beer. Wow, that's going to be very interesting. For today, we'll principal. see if that actually yeah. works out. Know, we're on a retirement like and benefits plan. That's right. But our expertise, we go, we go. We love this. Test. For me, I am back to the big boy match. Oh, Wisconsin. Yeah, and so you're asking me, and listen, I don't want to go to college. Swelling, big boy. And it's just for obviously. All right. Subscriber. Appreciate you guys coming in, getting ready for live on a commercial right now as we get started. Uh, we'll bring on some highlights and things, but the center for Purdue is seven foot four. I keep bringing that to attention because how does someone cover someone that's seven foot four? That's going to be interesting. I see some vulnerability. That can be and then we have for the Yukon like Huskies UConn. as we pull up their so roster. My attitude is okay to raise the defending here. national champions led by Donovan. Donovan. That's the guy people were talking about. Number 32. You see on the screen here. That's the guy to watch for today. A few other people. Great starters. When we have the starting lineup, when they make the announcement for the starting lineup, that's when it gets hyped in here. That's why we get people in here live and get started early. This is going to be interesting, as you guys can already tell. Good evening, good evening. Pick who you got. If you don't know who you got, then pick one for fun. UConn or Purdue. Going to be interesting. Obviously, we're getting on here early. See, we get the watch party started because people are going to start running. Now's in. the time for a new Honda. So we'll do a Save thousands play. with 2.9% financing started, or drive from two thirty nine dollars a month. Full Honda inventory is here. Cars, SUVs, trucks, vans are all in stock. Drive KBB.com's best value brand now. And choose your new your Honda Donovan with payments from two thirty nine a month or two point nine percent financing. Exactly the time for a new Honda is here. Center, when you like search a local Honda dealer today. He puts his arms in the air, right? Yeah, Literally, can you imagine? He puts his arms up. You pass it in. Who's going to guard him? You got to foul the guy. Then you get in foul trouble. That's going to be the problem. But let's see here. Hopefully, when the game gets started, we're going to get a lot of people into the interaction, have conversation. Cool little sounds here for people as well. 
experience My is we, trip to the to we are getting started early today which is freaking off i think that uh, he's going to do a hell of a job at and USC, so congratulations to, to him but calipari is succeeding so i know that calipari is, is candy is candy great. how are you feeling uh, one of the alumni members how are you feeling this uh, evening are you feeling much better i know you were in the other lobby you had a surgery how are you feeling but i think that the reason i'm shocked is because and Kentucky closer and closer to tip off blood. and ESPN's and next end, Wednesday I, doubleheader I Heat and Mavs 7:30 Eastern I've Time. That the Timberwolves um, in Denver to take on the Nuggets. Those those place in the Western uh, Conference coverage starts with NBA count. You're going to see the scoreboard and kick and up as well when the game gets started. The scoreboard will be right up in front and center. Do and UConn on the road. Brought to you by the West. Here we go. 11 and 0. Tournament game played in the Three thirty-five wins. Let's get ready for today's tip off Purdue versus UConn. I want to know you guys got right there in the chat. Put UConn to Purdue because when it gets started, the watch party is going to grow. I can see everybody that's in here right now, so I know who I'm talking to until it gets to be a riot in here. Look forward to meeting new people subscribing to the channel as well. I appreciate you guys. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for subscribing. You'll see the live count tick up as we refresh. Two first round exits to a number 14 and a number 15 seeds. You didn't make the tournament. Let's get started. It's going to be freaking awesome. I'm just telling you right now. If you're here for the first time, hit the like button, subscribe, and put where you're from. If you're here for the first time, put where you're from because I can see you right now. When a lot of people start coming in, I can't see everybody at first. So make sure you get in there right now. Put what city you in and what are you drinking during the game? What are you drinking? I had a girl yesterday on here talking. She said she was drinking something, and then she said she's driving in the car. I'm like, wait a second. Did you just say that? There's a great point, too, about, about black death for two basketball, but also the battle of the big. I'm not going to say that this is happening. It's going to get We don't get this all the time. Two giant big. We're getting closer to the players coming out into the court. All right, Candy's taking UConn. sitting right now. So if this is just for bragging rights. Sure. Had to set an over when this gets started and gets running, it's going to be very, very, very interesting. That's all I got to say. Is the best way to get, get to the Final Four? It is when you look under, this handsome. Just because I think the size and the length is going to be something that's going to bother us. Let's listen to what this guy's got to say now. And this is the live cast of the game also. You're going to hear everything. We'll see more of that than the past. I think both fan bases are happy they're smarter than you say. UConn's been here a million times right before. Like they've been to the big show, they've been to the big leagues. It isn't like you're getting a, a team or organization that hasn't been there a million times. Let's see, UConn. Okay, okay. Let's go, let's go. Who you got? UConn, Purdue. The game's getting to get kick off here shortly. Put where you're from with City in because when we get started live play by play, it's a lot harder to communicate. But right now, I can see everybody take a screenshot. And we have a live giveaway for people that are in here. They leave a message in the chat. Xbox PlayStation giveaway for today's fun and action. Yesterday was one giveaway to a random subscriber as well. Going out to another state. Kentucky this morning has an opportunity now to upgrade the program after Calgary. And what does that mean? Who should we be expecting to start hearing about at Kentucky in the next day? I cannot wait for the game to kick off because it's going to be a lot different. If you watched the game yesterday, you got a chance to see Caitlin Clark. Uh, obviously, South Carolina took that game. Iowa just could not do it. Caitlin Clark did not hang on. She didn't have the best games, obviously. But she had an excellent career, all-time leading scorer. A lot of people were like, oh, I like Caitlin Clark. She just didn't play that good. She got D'd up yesterday is what happened. She got D'd up. Think about it, Greeny. I realize I'm not Jim Cramer here this morning on Wall Street. Today, but I'm going to go over on this one. I think he's going to have a, a What was going on? I got that. Okay, great. Yes, Candy, yesterday's game was nuts. It was freaking nuts yesterday. Look at that. First time, like button, subscribe. We do live watch parties every single week. Monday through Friday, we're on live 10 a.m. every single freaking day. Get all the updates, NFL news, and action right away. Appreciate you guys subscribing. Driving. We are at 37,776 people. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're rammed. 
This is when a game gets started in kickoff, it's going to be very, very entertaining. Play by play, the entire time, the scoreboard will be at the top. You'll see the live updates. You'll see who's winning. You'll see stats. You'll see highlights. You'll see everything. That's why we had the live watch party. Yesterday's watch party was insane. A lot of fun. A lot of new subscribers. A lot of new faces. If you're in here for the first time, hit the like button, subscribe. And put what city you're in. That's what I love to do during the game. We're watching right now. Put what city you're in because it's so freaking fun. People are like, oh, I'm located here. I'm located here. I'm glad to see people from different countries and states enjoying the watch party. That's how we do it. As we are sitting here on the eve of the national championship game, and one that certainly will shake up things. They're talking about walking on the moon right now. Did you guys? They just said live on the announcement. The last guy at Purdue, X Y Z, was on the moon. They just said a guy from Purdue was on the moon. Like that's where they're taking the conversation right now. You guys know, which is why when the play ball play gets started, you gotta listen to us and have some fun out here. The lack of tournament success in the last couple seasons. Um, what are they saying now? What are they saying now for the game? Because the players are getting ready to come on the court. You know, everyone can for the tip off the game. It's your the first time in here. Hit the like button. Subscribe. We're going to build a big time watch party today. It's going to be so fun. Interesting. A lot of guys coming on. And they're, they're right now. They're getting hyped up right now. The highlights are. This is going to be a game you don't want to miss. UConn, Purdue yesterday, like I said. Caitlin Clark getting beat by South Carolina. was one of those games. You're like, what the hell? Uh, when a lot of the players look at this final four, Repeat. prime example of it. Only one shout out to the tattoo sponsor, appreciate it. The 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 thank you, appreciate it. All the ink. Who you guys are located if you're here for the first time? What city are you in? Again, what are you drinking for the game? But Zach Eady and company, with the way they play, I'm going to go with Purdue to win the game. There, this guy's picking Purdue, Zach Eady, I see why too. Seven foot four, that's what I'm saying. How do you not throw the ball? That's why I said yesterday, Cardosa, South Carolina. Throw the ball to the center. Like, get the ball to your center so that you can hold the ball in the air and put it off the backboard. It's really not that hard, especially when you're that much bigger. You've got to foul someone every single time if you want to actually stop him from scoring. you got to foul him. What do you do? Then you foul out, right? That's the situation we're looking at tonight. 15 years on, he leaves for Fayetteville. Let's go. Well, it's, it's funny with the national title and a historic potential Thanks for subscribing. Repeat Appreciate it. Purdue first ever national title. There's a lot of count there, but sometimes it gets held up and then it just refreshes the, the and it keeps on growing. 37,776 people. Mary Thanks to everybody else that's been joining me. If you first time in here, hit the like button, subscribe. We go live all the time, Monday through Friday. 10 a.m. and then we do all now play by plays there, for all the big uh, time games and I cannot and wait and for this game but also for the NFL season is going to be very interesting. good NBA coach uh, he, has a, he has a team that see what uh, else is going on, on here right now right and if you're in here right now for the standing, first time check this out and I'll pull it up again what do you think about this the live stream bonus and giveaways hit over 100 likes today a hundred dollar giveaway over 100 people in the live Xbox giveaway $50 super chat, I will take a shot and gain 1,000 subscribers, $1,000 giveaway. $100 super chat, I will bong a beer. And again, we're going to pass it off to Mike. The road so he can bong a beer. A, uh, becomes a factor in the surf. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, make no mistake. Yesterday, it was a PlayStation <laughs> Xbox there, giveaway, we very, very and an email went out to a basketball. lucky, lucky <laughs> guest. So and now we are waiting for their confirmation for address. I sent it out to them. To aim the it is a commercial break, so we'll wind down the audio for them and get ready for what's actually going to be happening here soon. To undergo a difficult process. And Now's the time for a new Honda. Who do Save you guys thousands got so with 2.9% financing or chat. drive from 239 a month. Full Honda inventory is here. Cars, okay, SUVs, got no trucks, vans all right. are all in stock. Listen, Ken, drive KBB.com's best value brand drinking. now. They're gonna be Choose your new you know, Honda with payments from 239 a month or 2.9% financing. The time for a new Honda is this here <laughs> when you search your local <laughs> Honda dealer that. today. Like, yeah, I'm drinking. You know, X, Y, Z, and then she goes, I'm we're like, what are you doing today? She goes, I'm driving, I'm going, wait, and you're drinking, and then what? All right, let's not announce that, right? Like, that's the worst thing to do on a lot. Is but hey, five -year it's getting ready to get interesting. To what about the eclipse today? At Arkansas. Was it a lunar the or solar eclipse? expected to be completed in the next 24 hours. It what is, is going on here as the game gets ready for tip-off here shortly? 
Calipari, the second I'll tell you what right now. If you're in for the first time, it's going to be big time today in the chat. I appreciate you guys. Per year. Had Kentucky fired appreciate you guys coming in. They would have owed him $32 million. Let me tell you what, I, Zach Eady, uh, as this game gets ready to get started, Zach Eady, seven foot four. All I'm saying, you better double team, triple team that guy. I don't see anybody can stop him, but UConn's not their first rodeo. They've been here a million times before, and that's the whole situation with the organization. They're ready for this game, obviously. It should be really damn good, and tip-off is coming here soon. Let's see what the coaches have to say, right? Like... How do how does UConn defend that? All right, all right, all right. They got a little highlight they're showing right now. Getting ready. Now's the time for a new Honda. Save thousands with 2.9% financing or drive from $239 a month. Full Honda inventory is here. Cars, SUVs, trucks, vans are all in stock. Drive KBB.com's best value brand. Now, choose your new Honda with payments from $239 a month or 2.9% financing. The time for a new Honda is here when you search your local Honda dealer today. We're getting Honda tonight for sure. And Brittany, yeah, the Eclipse, I'm like, is it lunar eclipse or solar eclipse? And Tracy kind of helped me out earlier. She's like, oh, I think it was uh, whatever I said. She said the opposite. I said it was a solar eclipse. I think, or yeah, I said lunar eclipse. She goes, wasn't it a solar eclipse? I'm like, whatever, man. There's an eclipse out there. And people are like driving. I'm going up the highway and people are stopping. Like, okay, there's a lunar eclipse or a solar eclipse or whatever the case may be. People are blocking the highway. And I'm like, if you block the highway, we're going to be out here during the whole thing. Like, if you keep driving, you're going to get home. You don't got to worry about it. Pull over at the gas station, pick up some glasses so you can check it out, which I didn't do that. But I did see the sky go dark and then light and dark and then light. People are really getting confused. I can tell you that right now. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for subscribing. Getting ready for the game to start shortly. Let's see here what we got going on. New people, new faces. That's what it's all about. New people coming into the chat. Hit the like button, subscribe, comment where you're from, and also put who you got, UConn or Purdue. And if you don't know, just pick one. That's the whole fun about it, right? Like, you literally have a 50% chance of getting it right without even knowing any sport you're watching. Like, UConn or Purdue, just know that Purdue has a seven foot four, you know, seven foot four center. Really hard to stop. 34 and 4 on the season, and UConn is 36 and 3. So, awfully close. South Carolina was 37 and 0, and beat uh, Iowa another 38 and 0. First time I've seen that in a long time. But we are getting ready. Let me get back here and check this out. Pull this game up. Keeping themselves relevant, even when they don't win. Live. And over the last four years, you've had two first rounds. Let's get the game lined up here. This is going to get really interesting. I hope you guys are coming here for the first time. Understand what's actually going to go on tonight. Everyone that's coming here for the first time, the like button, subscribe. Appreciate you guys subscribing to the platform. We're getting ready to have the game kicked off live. And yesterday was super hype. Yes, it was so much fun. I got to tell you. All right, all right, all right. Listen, if you're in for the first time, like button, subscribe. Put what city you're in or who you got for tonight's game. Purdue and Huskies, let's go live. Let me get that on. Watch on YouTube TV. He's active. He can run the floor. Bang. Keeps things in play and yes. We got it in now. We're connected again. Here we go. Now's the time for a new Honda. Save thousands with 2.9% financing or drive from $239 a month. Full yeah, Honda inventory is here. Seven foot Cars, SUVs, seven foot trucks, vans are all in stock. Drive like, KBB.com's best value brand. Now, choose your new Honda with payments from $239 a month or 2.9% financing. The time for a new Honda is here when you search your local Honda dealer today. They throw him the ball, catch the ball, turns around. There's nobody there because the guy's like six foot. So he catches the ball, shoots the ball. That's why they're freaking 34 and 4. I got to tell you, when the watch party gets started here and gets going, when he got knocked out by Oakland a couple of weeks ago, that was the second time 
in three seasons he lost in the first round. That, that is unforgivable, and I think he can Greeny within a whisker of getting fined. Well, that's winning back-to-back -back national championships. <laughs> but for Matt Painter we'll and Purdue, tonight is program. about no redemption, a chance for them to bring things Redemption? After the disappointing loss, Are you guys ready for tip-off? Who you got? Who you got? Purdue, UConn, put it in the chat. Who you got? And don't wait. Listen, people, again, yesterday, wait till after the first quarter, pick your team. Pick now. They're going to make the announcement. Here we go. Here we go. For UConn. And what does that mean? It's all about history. Tonight's drone coverage is presented by AT&T Connected Camp. Bang! It's game time, baby. We'll be back here in Phoenix. Messages. It's game time. Appreciate you guys coming in today. Appreciate it. We're getting ready to get started. Let's see what's going on here. Live ticker. All right, all right, all right. First time in. Like the like. Hit the like button and subscribe. Put it in the damn chat what team you got. UConn or Purdue, because if you pick the wrong team, I'm going to call you out during the game. I'm not Jim Cramer here this morning on Wall Street uh, today, but Kentucky just saved 33 million by not firing Cal. So they have a surplus of plus 13 if you're doing the math here before the Dow opens. I think uh, they could say, why not go after the go after the the, the best coach in the SEC right now? Who Trust is? Candy, you get it. You got it. UConn, right? Like you got it. Yeah, Brittany's got UConn too. And recalibrate your when people come in here, remember yesterday, hundreds of people safe, pop in there safe, and like, everyone starts picking their team last second. Like, oh, I got, you know, I, I got South Carolina. Of course you got South Carolina in the fourth quarter, one minute to go up by 10. Like, who you got, man? Pick your team early on. Subscriber. Appreciate you subscribing. The live counts right there. I have to keep on reloading. It typically runs up as you see it live. If I reload it, it will refresh the amount of subscribers. I appreciate that. I'm ready for the damn tip off. I am ready for the tip off. As cut through as a hire as you could possibly make. Uh, the name, go, the brand, go. the identity that he brings. Oh, brand. man, it is, uh, it is a packed house. It is a packed house. I'm telling you right now, it's a packed house. Number one and number one. Okay, that's what you got. Number one, Purdue versus number one, UConn in the tournament. As you know, they're both not number one overall. When you start the tournament, you got one side and the other side. That's where you got it. Here we go. Please rise. And those who support our freedom at home and abroad. Here we go. National Anthem. The colors is provided Why by the Fauna Awesome Nation Color Guard. I think a lot of it, KC, has to tribal to nations of Arizona. Here we go, here we go. Our student and alumni oh, tribal oh, members from Arizona's local. You know, in the watch party, get started, people start running in. Fan base and, and how they responded. Uh, and now, please welcome the, the, Arizona State, State University alum representing the Navajo Dene Nation, Kapara Hodges, for the singing of our national anthem. All right, here we go, here we go. Listen to this. Uh, with that program uh, but to me I, I think it, it was maybe time where your success has started to become something that's used against you and the identity of one and done and trying to win in this era uh, when a lot of these teams and you look at this final four prime example of it only one freshman starter out of the four teams that made it all the way here to Glendale uh, I think a lot of people in Kentucky just got a little upset about how things have kind of been going over the last couple of years and I think for Coach Calabari, he knows that he can still get it done. An opportunity to get a press start in a new program uh, by benefit those programs. Through the perilous fight, or the ramparts we washed, were so gallantly to me. So in the military right there. He has a team that's uh, on the cusp of the play-in game right now, and he's an NBA 
Wow, that was great. Gotta love that, right? You gotta love that. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go. If you're in here for the first time, like, when subscribe, let's get ready for the game. Tip off is about to start. Wow, this is going to be interesting. Just saying right now, if you're here for the first time, hit the like button, subscribe. Let's see the live ticker go up. I appreciate okay. you guys. All right, appreciate that, appreciate that. You will see that run up by a Now's the time for a new Honda. Save thousands with 2.9% financing. Or drive from two thirty nine a month. Full Honda inventory is here. Listen, Cars, SUVs, yeah, exactly trucks, center, vans center are all in stock. Stop drive KBB.com's best value brand now. Check. Choose your yeah, new Honda with payments from two thirty nine a month, month or two point nine percent financing. The this time for a new Honda game, guys, is here. Time, when you search your local Honda dealer today, and I keep saying that people sometimes just scared to pick who they got because they don't want to be wrong. Don't worry about it because you can't lose any money anyway. Anyway, just pick, Our put who you got in the chat just so we can talk shit Kentucky's to you when you're losing. That's what I like to do. I picked Iowa yesterday. I'm like, oh, Caitlin Clark's on fire. And then the South Carolina's like running back. And I'm like, Arkansas. damn, they look the pretty damn good. The deal is expected to be completed in the next 24 hours. It is a gigantic question. All right. Purdue vs. UConn. Oh, right. Welcome to Phoenix for the 2024 Final Four. This is going to be good. Let me just tell you. Picking their third Final Four appearance. Winners out of the Midwest region. The Purdue Boilermakers. Here we go. Big time. This is gonna be lit. I'm just telling you right now. Jones, Mute your TV and listen to this. Trust me. Mute your TV and listen to this live cast and watch the game on another platform. But listen to this live cast. I'm telling you, it's gonna be. Lit. Let's go. Boom. Who you guys got? Put in the chat. For the Purdue Boilermakers. At forward, a 6'9 sophomore from Sellersburg, Indiana. Number four, Trey Kaufman Ray. Let's go. Trey Kaufman, number four. At center, a 7'4 senior from Toronto, Ontario. Number 15, Zach Eady. Zach Eady, number 15, seven foot four. What? Dude, it's towering everybody. 6'4", sophomore from Fort Wayne, Indiana. Number two, Fletcher Lawyer. Fletcher Lawyer. Fletcher Lawyer, number two, sophomore guard. Here we go, it's That's game time. Six foot sophomore from Westfield, Indiana. Number three, Braden Smith. Braden Smith, number three. Here we go. Mike, you see what's going on right now. Like it's getting lit. One senior from Evanston, Illinois, number 55, Lance Jones. Lance Jones, number 55, senior guard, getting ready to go. And we're going to announce the UConn Huskies right now. And now making their seventh Final Four appearance. Winners out of the East region, the UConn Huskies. Wow. The crowd is going absolutely insane. Here we go. go. Hit the like button, guys. Huskies will play for the national championship again. Upstairs. Let's go, Mike. Going to the sky for the jam. Spencer, the jumper is pure. Now shine no shadow, because we make for the star. Clay Kong comes Yo, these highlights are sick, too. Highlights are sick. Yes, sir. UConn is a machine. There we go. We're about to announce the UConn Huskies. Highlight for the Huskies. Oh! 
Sean Huskies. At forward, a 6'8 sophomore from Southboro, Massachusetts. 6'8 sophomore. Alex Caravan. Alex Caravan, number 11. At center, a 7'2 sophomore from Bristol, Connecticut. There he is. Number 32. Donovan Klingen. Donovan Klingen, number 32, baby. That's the guy, sophomore. Gonna be rocking today. At guard, a 6'5 graduate student from El Paso, Texas. Here we go. Number two. Number two. Tristan, Tristan Newton. Newton. Be smooth, the Yukon Huskies are At guard, too. a 6'6 freshman from Cummington, Georgia. Number five, Stefan Castle. Stefan Castle. Let's go. 12. At guard, a 6'4 graduate student from Davidsonville, Maryland. Number 12. Here we go. Pam Spencer. So this is going to be unbelievable. And introducing the head coaches for Purdue in his 19th season for the Boilermakers. And coaching his 38th game of Purdue. Matt Painter. For UConn in his sixth season for the Huskies and coaching his 18th Dan Hurley. this game, Dan Hurley. Here we go, here we go. Tip off. We are moments away from getting it started. In here we go, here we go, here we go. UConn and Purdue for the national title. Coverage of the NCAA Men's National Championship game is sponsored by The Home Depot, the official home improvement partner of March Madness. I hope you guys are ready for a tip-off. We're getting ready to start the game right now. This is the game. QQQ, official ETF of the NCAA, and by the U.S. Army, the all you can be. Oh, Candy, you see Mike came into the chat, right? We're getting ready to get started. Appreciate people subscribing. Get ready. We got it on uh, a commercial break for tip off right now. We're about minutes away from the start. Actually, probably seconds away. 50 seconds or so for tip off. Let me just double check a couple things here. Good to go. We got some highlights to show you. Got some players to pull up. We got a lot going on. First time, hit the like button, subscribe, and get ready for the tip off live play by play through the entire game right here. You're going to see it happening. And put who you got in the chat, okay? Candy wasn't shy. Mike's not shy. Brittany wasn't shy. People that aren't shy, put who you got. UConn or Purdue, don't wait till the end of the first quarter to put your team because we're going to call you out when you're wrong on here. See who you guys got. $12 from Pizza Hut. Any pizza, any crust, $12. Smoke weed every day. Smoke weed every day. So order any way you want. It's going to get interesting to say right now. What you do. You do truck money. We are just moments away else. from tip off here. Coca Cola commercial right now. I gotta tell you, watching these commercials, you're like, oh, do commercials really do that well? And I'm sitting here watching the commercial. I'm like, damn, I got my coke right now. Like, they're doing something right. They're doing something right. I think it's shocking just based on what we've heard. And as we get started with it right here, Mike, you know, we'll drop it in there again for people to see. Again, here they are. Goals for today's stream. Hit over 100 likes. $100 giveaway over 100 people in the live. We're going to do an Xbox giveaway in $50 super chat. I'm taking a shot, getting 1,000 subs. I'm giving away $1,000 and $100 super chat. We are going to bong a beer. And that is being passed off to Mike in the chat. You see him there. Lions talk sports. And one that certainly will shake up things. We've got a number one versus a number one. The Big East. Here we go. Tip Here we go. Our they are jumping in the stadium right now, like literally. Mute your TV if you got the game. Mute your TV and listen to this live cast here, and still watch the game if you can. If not, if you don't can't watch the game, then just watch here because it's going to be entertaining. As more people come in for the watch party. It's everything you've worked for. Now, 40 minutes. Here we go. We'll decide the tip off. Championship. Who do you think said the tip off right now? Obviously, Purdue. Aiden Purdue goes to Purdue. Comes across right away at half court. Purdue's got the ball. Three point line drives the lane. Fake it. Kicks it back out. Look at this. Look at this. 
Purdue with a win over NC State. The defense is the defense is on lock right now. I'm not gonna lie. UConn is out there. Oh, right to seven foot four. Right to seven foot four. He's right in the middle. He's got a big time guy on him too. Good defense. Oh, Purdue with the rebound. Jump ball. Jump ball. Jump ball. Jump ball. Jump ball. Right away. Right away. Listen, I'm telling you, he's seven before he got deed up. I didn't think so. Two, three, four times banging in. Whoa! You said it best, I this, de <laughs> this guy's <laughs> deeing him up for real. Here, this is gonna be short. physical. So Crossing half court, UConn with the ball. Said, here we go. Short before with Zach Eady. They, <laughs> they got some big no time stunts. players out here. Nice little flare three ball. Miss. Missed it too strong. Rebound. Rebound. Smith, here comes Purdue at the court. Crossing half court. In other areas. Here we go. We want to pull it, pass it in inside the paint. Puts it up and he scores. Puts the first points on the board. Good shot right there. Purdue gets a bucket up 2 0. 2 0. Here we go. Appreciate you subscribing. UConn with the ball. Three point line. In this, tournament, but this is going to get pretty live right now. He shoot, he puts up the three, and it's good. It's good. Just like that, he puts it in. Like, really? Like nothing. The, cra the, the stadium is hopping. Just so you guys are hopping. Mute those TVs. Listen to this live cast. We're going hot. We got highlights and everything we're going to bring up on here. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Appreciate you subscribing to the platform. Thank you. Live in the chat right now. Put where you're from. Who you got? Eddie. Oh, and one. Purdue and one. Listen, right now in the chat, put who you got. Do not wait until the end of the first quarter. I know you guys are going to do it. We get 100 people in here. And people are like, oh, yeah. Pick right now in the chat. UConn or Purdue. Let's go. Bang. Hits it. 5-3. Purdue takes the little early lead to start. Comes up the court. UConn crossing half court. Brings the ball over half court. Let's see what happens UConn, here. Six national championship game. At the three-point line. And oh, in the national Put it right here so I can see this damn thing even better. Year. Lincoln very active. Gives bumps. Gets this little drop D. Up. Oh. Foul. His in, and he's fouled. And he's fouled. Lawyer. Of course you're going to get fouled. They're going to take advantage of that, guys. That drop D. They're going to take advantage of that. Corner. you got these big-time centers in there. Make some tough shots. Tristan Newton. Here we go. <laughs> Back but to right it. Way you see, I mean, you can see it to the eye. I mean, so so appreciate subscribing to the platform. To Thank you. The it will automatically update and Newton refresh. At his height, six, six, appreciate the you guys. You see refresh right there. Someone to subscribe. Thank you. Here. Newton, size. Spencer, solid six four. Castle, six six. Braden Smith, six foot. Jones, six one. Lawyer, Look, all six, I'm four. saying right now is everybody on the court is super tall. Like I'm six three and I'm super small on the court right now. At seven foot two, UConn has the size of Buckets. at the guard position. Five five. Sounds very envious, doesn't it? Bring the ball <laughs> to court. <laughs> you caught that, huh? Uh, uh, this is the guy they are D and up. Purdue, I gotta lie. These UConn Huskies are playing like half right. court D right now. Nice Almost like full court press. Five goes up. Oh, oh rejected. Rejected. Oh, no! Rejected. That's what that was for. Good defense there. Caravan Lillick is slapped back. Here we go. Look in the At the three-point line, this is it off. In the box, in the paint. Goes up off the glass, and he scores it like nothing. Literally scores like nothing. Didn't we get deed up there against the glass? The transfer from Rutgers. Oh. Perfect piece for Dan Hurley's squad. 7-5 lead. Dan Hurley's squad is going bananas out here. Right here we go. Three-point line. Oh, Throws in the paint to Edie. Right, right to Edie. Goes up. Bang. Scores again. Like nothing. Like nothing. Like nothing. Put who you got in the chat. People People are so scared to put who they got for the game. Rebound. Purdue with the ball. Crossing. Oh. Threw it out of bounds. Literally threw it out of bounds. Sloppy gameplay. Threw the ball completely out of bounds. Like you, this is the NBA, sorry, baby, it's the NCAA championship. You rebound the ball, kick it to your guy, don't pass it out of bounds. 
Man, obviously Clayton Dots got the coach Horton, who not hot fouled. right now. Zach Eady, one of the best in college basketball. Yes. Good defense, better offense. And both guys Hit the like button, subscribe. Thanks, subscribe. Thanks for all the subscribers coming down. in right now. I appreciate you guys. Tough, just a little under two fouls a game. How are we looking right now? At the three-point line, drives in. Steps back, one to put it up with a little floater. Oh, this is an off. Oh, and he slams it down. He literally just slammed it down. Donovan slammed it down. UConn, up 9-7. They're going to have to ride that. Everybody was looking forward to the unstoppable force versus the Let's go. Object. Let's go. He's got a counter move. Edie Up off the glass, Edie. And that's part of his game he's improved on. That last hand Up off right the glass, Edie, Edie is making shoulder. plays early on. And easy at the basket. Early on, early on. Right now, Purdue, I mean, the guards are getting into the paint. The gu that's right. exactly right. The guards Purdue's are getting defense. into the paint. How are you letting the guards get into the you're paint like that? The post, Seven foot four. One. Back out, Spencer, 10 to shoot, Klingon hot Let's go. Three, 8 to shoot. There UConn. End of shot clock, switch it. Trying to find Klingon something to pass it to, puts Spencer. it up, bang, buckets, 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 like buckets on top of buckets. That's what's going on right now. The high percentage shots, even low percentage shots are dropping. With a lot of spice to UConn. Spencer has scored seven of the 11 for UConn. Back inside. Bang! Off right the one. glass. The D was on him. Like fast right break, fast right break for UConn. Goes off the glass. Doesn't go. Doesn't go. Kicks it out. Three-point line. Shoots a three. Oh, he pump faked it. Pump faked it. Did they just call a travel? They called a travel. They called a travel. They called a travel. They called a travel. And now we're heading to a commercial break. They just called a travel. You know why they called the travel? Because he went for the pump fake. Let me tell you something on a commercial break. He went for a pump fake right there. These guards are literally driving the lane. And you got centers in there, seven foot four. Another guy's like six foot eight. Another guy's seven foot, whatever. You can't let these little guards drive the lane like that. You got to get them arms up and smack that thing away. As soon as they smack that thing away, you're going to hear. Make some noise! Every time there's a rejection. Appreciate you subscribing to the platform. Hit the like button, subscribe. Enjoy the watch party on a commercial break right now. Thank all of you guys for joining us live. We are live every single day, just so you guys know, at 10 a.m. doing live shows. But on top of that, we are live doing all of the amazing play-by-plays for the high-quality games, obviously. And I got some cool highlights. You okay I'll show you in a minute. They got a Home Depot commercial with Shaquille O'Neal was by the rim. They're showing a Home Depot commercial right now with Shaquille O'Neal cleaning and painting the backboard. Like Shaquille O'Neal is everywhere. He's Papa John's. Every, everywhere you go, people are like, yeah, Shaquille O'Neal owns that. Shaquille O'Neal did that. <laughs> like this dude. And then he gets on live TV and he's like, <laughs> he's talking. You got to love Shaquille O'Neal, man. Guy's rich as shit. Talking under his breath like this. <laughs> he's like, God. What we got on here? Derek Bird. Yes. Connect the dots. On any smartphone with your choice. Oh, Lowe's. Running. Hey, what do you guys think? You guys got put in the chat right now. I thought Hope all of you guys are doing. What are you guys drinking? I train with this chair every day. I push rider athletes and see if I can comment something here with you guys because everybody else. Seeing their excitement. What are you guys drinking? That's a question right now. What are you drinking? My marathon is for special. You see the question. And helping athletes like Yusuf realize. Man, this is, I, I got to tell you, the game is so live and so lit right now. People are literally at the edge of their seats the whole game. These are, they're shooting shots and it, they're all high percentage shots, but when they're shooting, it's like the accuracy is unreal. And yeah, people would say, yeah, obviously the NCAA championship. I'm just saying a lot of these guys are NBA talent. And um, you're talking people like Bronny James are trying to get drafted. And Le LeBron's like, he's the best. You know, he should be in the league. He's going to be great. I'm just saying right now, I don't know if Bronny can hang with these guys. And I like, I love LeBron James. Been great to watch for all these years. Do you think that Bronny could hang with these players? Like in the chat right now, if you don't think he can, put an N for no. If you think Bronny can hang with these players, put a Y for yes. Doesn't seem like he can if you ask me. Just the second time, seven footers have We're getting ready to get started. Back in the lab. Listen, this is the game you guys want to see. You kind of Purdue, put in the chat. You kind of Purdue. They're taller and they're ballers. 
Edie and Clinton. Here we go. Been prolific. I don't think we're Appreciate you subscribing. I'll play you some ski low later. I'll catch up another couple of Here we go. Let's get back <laughs> to right it. Now, uh, Let's get back to it. Giving the two and taking away the Hit the, the like button, three. subscribe. Hit the like button, subscribe. Watch that live counter up. go up. A couple of changes here. Mason Gillis and Camden Heidi in for Purdue. Five minutes going by in this first half. Here we go. Purdue with the ball, three point line. Hands it in, hand back to the guy, drives the lane. Whoa, Ali Oop, he hits the Ali Oop. He just hit the Ali Oop like nothing to his seven foot four center, throws it up, and Ali Oop throws it down. Dynamite at the rim. Dynamite, dynamite. Points have come in the paint. Whoa. We're all tied up. UConn with the ball, out, three point line. By Heidi. Screen, Brings in, drives it, lane again. It Picks it back, three-point line. One to go for it. Another three ball goes up. Bang, smacked it. Smacked it. Smacked the three ball again. Like, are these guys, the percentage of shooting is so freaking high and accuracy is so high. Again, are in touch. Can Bronny James handle these players? For why? For yes and for no. There's a little change now on the timeout. Ball screen. Drives the lane. Another guard drives the lane. Goes off the glass. Missed it. UConn just got fouled. Not a good foul back there. Castle just got fouled. Foul called after the miss. After the miss. The alley oop was raw, though. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Make some noise. I'm just saying. Downhill. Edie has been efficient thus far. But Hit the like button if you're the first time. Hit the like button. Subscribe. You're going to see other people coming in here shortly. Foul called on Lance Jones. Hassan Diara is in for UConn. Look at this. We're trying to get to 100 people watching. Make it easy for us. If you're in right now, stick in here. Hit 100 people really fast. Got rejected. Just got rejected. UConn with the ball. Drives the lane. Goes up. Rejected again. He just got rejected two times in a row. Like he legit, Zach Eady just rejected the guy twice. One guy goes up, gets rejected. The pass guy, this guy tries, gets rejected. Let's go. <laughs> Three point. Rebound. Purdue. Who do you think? Eady. Goes up the court. Here we go. Purdue crosses half court. Very clever. Are they going to shoot the ball? The Are they going to shoot a three or give it to Big Ben? Go up for the screen. Three. This guy, 7'4", is just running right. the court, to be honest. Shots the lane. Gets it to Edie. He can go up with it. Go up with it. Go up with it. He goes up with it. Bang! Hits it. That's what I'm saying. Let's go. Just went straight up with it. No problem. Also, too, the screen and roll action getting the ball inside the Edie. That's what Matt Painter has done adjustment-wise with this offense this year. Eight points for Edie. UConn drives the lane off the glass. Okay, off the glass. Off the play, Diara recognized it, and he attacks the rim for two. New subscriber. Appreciate it, appreciate it. So hard to defend. Appreciate the subscriber. You can see a live right there. Pops up on the screen every time somebody subscribes. Watch out, ticker go up right now. Appreciate it. New subscriber. Here we go. Asking for it. Much better. Edie with the ball nice in the lane. Goes pass. up again. Scores again. And one. Make some time. You just can't stop this guy, man. Let's go. Can't stop him. Edie goes up countless times. His accuracy percentage, his arms, he put his arm up. My arm's pretty long, right? His arm is sky and high. Like he's like this. And then there's a whole nother arm there. You're looking at the UConn guy, like, like he gets to the bench, and people are like, what's going on? He looks at him, he's like, what do you want me to do, man? The guy's like 10 feet out of here. Foul line. Bang, hits it. Shot clock at 1616. I would just pass the ball every single time. Every time I got the ball, I just dish it off to Edie every time. See what happens. You're going to get the guy in foul trouble for sure. Change here for Purdue, Miles Colvin. New subscriber. Appreciate you guys subscribing. Hit the like button, hit the like button, hit the like button on the live. Oh, this it off. Back door. UConn scores. 18-16, UConn, 
to go in the first. Always makes the right play for Dan what a game so far. Like 18-16, this if you want a national championship game, NCAA tournament through the Final Four all the way to the top one and one from the East and West. Pardue's got the ball, dish up to Edie. In the center, kicks it out, three-point shot. Kicks it around again, back to Edie on the box. Goes for the three. Off the rim. Rebound. Oh, D is on luck. Oh, and they called a foul. And they called a foul. Woo, UConn up by two, 18-16. UConn up by two. Let me tell you something. I Watching this game, what I see so far is, a, is an easy combination. The, all the guards are driving the lane. Like, all the Purdue guards are driving the lane. You get down, you slow up, dish it off to Edie because all those guys that have come pass on you, right? They got to pass off. And as soon as they get to you, you dish it off to Edie. You got a guy seven foot four standing there with the ball. One-on-one -on -one is so hard to cover a guy right next to the damn rim. Like, literally, he stands at the foul line. He can throw the ball. I can almost touch the rim from the foul line. His arm's so damn long. If he gets the ball in the paint, and he's right there. You got to D that guy up with like two and three people. What does that do? Opens up the three-point shot to kick it out for the three ball. That's why this team right now is so damn hard to step. And we're here 18 to 16 with 11, 28 to go. In the first, we're getting ready to get started. If you join us for the first time, hit the like button and subscribe because we're getting ready to dive into one of the biggest games, obviously, of the year, especially in NCAA. Yesterday, Caitlin Clark got beat Cardosa in South Carolina. They had a great start against Carolina, but they came back. Was hard to watch, heartbreaking. Caitlin Clark is basically done. She's moving on to bigger and better things in the WNBA, but she was a rock star at Iowa. And now we're here. Purdue, you kind. If you're in here for the first time, put who you got. Smoke weed every day. And listen, don't be scared to put your damn team. We see in the chat, hit the like button, subscribe. I appreciate you guys. Thanks for subscribing to the platform. You'll see the live ticker go up as we refresh it. And the whole damn thing is supposed to go by its damn self. Right? And I'm watching, and I'm like, are you going to freaking up there? It worked so hard to get this shit rocking properly. made a promise. So did we. Appreciate subscribing. Hit the like button. Hit the like button. Hit the like button. Pays off. We're getting ready to get started for the watch party even further here. As we get through the first, you will see a lot of people come in here and start bullshitting. Put what city you're from. You know what? I'll just get it started right now. I'm in. Bet you guys don't know where I'm even at right now, but here we are. Bang. I'm in Miami. That's where I'm at. Where are you guys at? What do you choose to do? Thanks for subscribing. Here we go. I cannot wait for this to get to. is yours. Back to the game here. We're getting ready to get kicked back off here. The crowd is going absolutely During bananas. Out, Dan Hurley at UConn was really working the officials at Roman Let's go. Every day. Every day. Every day. A lot of frustration there. How do you feel you guys have been handling Edie? What city are football? you guys in you know what, right uh, now in the chat? He's a tough cover. You know, we're, we, we're going to have to mix it up a lot more. Um, and we got to force him off his spot a little bit. We got to dig more. We got to trap more. See, Candy, we got to get them talking, uh, right? I don't know. Derek, you still in here? Mike, you in here? We got to get these people in the live talking, having fun, having a drink. What are you drinking in here? Make it a watch party, right? There's a lot of people in here right now that are in here. Kind of, he went up in a little bit of intensity when Klingon came off of the court. Listen, all I'm saying is, what are people doing right now? hard with Klingon off. He wants them to really watch Edie tight when Klingon's not in there. Here we go. Inside. We're back at it. Purdue They're with the ball. Three-point line. Johnson trying to extricate the are they going to? Are they going to? The oh, foul for sure. Of course you got to foul that man. He said, I've been saying this. He's seven foot four. Foul him. The fouling him. You're going to have, you're going to run through the whole damn UConn lineup foul this guy. Because everyone's going to get fouled out by the end of the, by the end of the first half. You're going to see a lot of people in foul trouble. I'm just saying. I know. I'm, I need to sip on something. For Johnson in that short stint, clinging back on the floor for UConn. Have a brew or something or a mixed drink. Off the glass, a floater. Purdue, 18-18. Nice shot there. All right, all right. You come with the ball at the three-point line. This shit out. Clinton screens out top. Okay. 
Drawing the screen. The screen is number one. It's like you watch college basketball or any basketball. Screen after screen. Jumper. No good. Rebound Purdue. Got the ball coming up across half court. This guy looks like he's like five foot because his teammate's seven foot, 100. Jumper. No good. Fade away. Jumper doesn't go for Purdue. UConn with the ball across the half court. Comes up. At the three-point line. They are hanging out at the three-point line. Hanging out at the three-point line. Oh, rejected. They didn't call the foul, but he fell on the ground. Purdue with the fast break goes off the glass, gets rejected at the other end. Yo, the re rejection is crazy. The three ball. UConn with the three ball, man. Getting it lit. Getting it lit. Huskies have won 11 straight NCAA The three ball. The three ball. That is the longest streak all time. Driving the lane. Oh, hits Edie. Woo. He, he didn't even realize the ball was coming. Appreciate you subscribing. Appreciate you subscribing. Appreciate it, guys. Appreciate it. You'll see the subscriber count go up right now. Appreciate it. National champion with officially licensed locker room tees, hats, and more. Appreciate all you guys subscribing. We're at 37,780 people. Thank you. If you're the first time subscribing, watch the count go up. We are live every day, Monday through Friday, just so you know, at 10 a.m. Subscribe. Hit the notification bell. We do live shows every day, but now we're doing play-by-plays. Just added that. And shout out to our tattoo sponsor. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I don't know if you could even see it. Inkaholic. Boom, 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 boom. And wherever you guys are located, put down there right now where you're at. Stop being scared. Candy's not scared. Foul shot. Bang, hits it. Nine attempts. Generally, you gave this kid to keep him up. There we go. Last you come with the ball across half court. Win the national championship, Michigan. Are they going to pull up and hit a three? The three ball is money for UConn right now. That's what's keeping them in this right now. The three ball. Some of us, it doesn't seem that long. <laughs> Nine <laughs> thirty to go in the first. There we go. Picks it back. Drives the lane. Edie. Oh, back door. The defense is rocking right now. The defense is rocking right now. Drives the lane, goes up. Oh my God! Oh my God! This guy's playing like he's seven foot. This small guard. He may not be small on the court. He looks a little small. But like I said, you know how that is. Let's get it rocking, guys. Let's get it rocking. First time hit the like button, subscribe. A ball screen, turn the corner and roll. Let's go. At the three-point line. Donovan kicks it back. Oh, he shoots a jumper. Off the rim. Eden with the rebound. Kicks it back. Crossing half court. Purdue with the ball. Backing it down, backing it down, backing it down. The screen. Drops it down. Oh, whoa. Just got kneed in the face. Just got kneed in the face and part of the back of the head. Trey Kaufman Red and Smith, uh, Smith has He got me in the head. I'm not gonna here. lie. He got me. Nice find, the big time dive. Oh. Ooh. So that's number two awkward. on You want to talk about an awkward landing? You want to talk about an awkward landing? Awkward landing. Oh. They show that replay. So oh. With two. Got got with two. And it's gonna go the other way. Eden puts his arms up. Listen, Eden, Eden for Purdue so puts Mike his arms Jones up, right? Then he puts his arms up like this, and he's touching the rim. <laughs> he puts it, if he puts his arms up like this, he's touching the rim. Like, can you imagine how good you'd be at basketball? If you just put your arm up like this and touch the rim? Heidi checks in. Guy's like, he looks like he's 10 foot. I'm not lying. He looks 10 foot. Mute your TVs and listen to this. Hit the like button, subscribe. New subscriber, thank you. In their last New subscriber, thank you. The only loss coming to Kansas. You count with the ball. You don't leave your feet. Purdue takes it. Purdue takes it. Turnover, UConn. Turnover, UConn. Turnover, UConn. Lincoln's got to get touches on the other. Come on now. Wow, again, again. Eden, you can't stop this guy. Right now, Edie is feeling Ooh, it They're showing other other states back home, watching Purdue fans going bananas in the stands. Going bananas in the stands. 
He is exhausted with that. They're showing too. Purdue fans going Screen bananas back home right now. Here we go. Here we go. You count with the ball. The what jumper. can you do? It's 21-23. Purdue's up by two. The three ball. Cancel. Off the rim. Off the rim. Rebound, Purdue. Here we go. Bringing the ball up the court. Across the half court. They, if they get it to Eden again. Oh, she's a jumper. No good. UConn with the ball. Bringing it back up the court right now. Across the half court. Let's go. You got to put the three ball up, UConn. You got to put the three ball up. Because that's what you've been doing. Drives a lane. Oh. Oh, nice, shot, nice, shot, nice, nice shot, nice shot, no! nice shot. Nice shot, nice shot, can't lie, nice shot. He went right up over Zach Eady with that one. I'm not gonna... <laughs> you gotta be brave for that, brave. We're tied at 23. Tied at 23. to go in this first half. Here we go. Oh, oh, to Eden. He walked, he walked, he walked. Travel, travel, travel. Can't do that. And the third for This game's kicking off pretty damn good. With these two big guys battling for Dew and UConn. Wow. Trying to win the national championship. We're tied at 23. I'm telling you right now, as this game is unwinding right now, people are looking at this going, this is a championship game. This is why both these teams are here. You got excellent gameplay, excellent defense, excellent guards driving lane, excellent shooters, high percentage shots. Eden, who's seven foot four, get the ball into him. Donovan, on the other side, he's also skying this guy walking around. These guys, I'm not going to lie. Some of these guys look like dinosaurs out here. I'm not sure how tall everybody is, but there's some dinosaurs on the court right now. There are some dinosaurs out there. We are getting ready to come back. If you're here for the first time, hit the like button and make sure you subscribe to the platform. We're live every day at 10 a.m. doing live all sports, NFL, and I relax it down for my fit for the play-by-play. -play. I'm always in a suit and a dress shirt doing all my live shows, but for the play-by-play, -play, put the little hat on and my headphones in so I can hang out with you guys for the watch party. Appreciate you sub subscribing. We are at 37,780 people. Thank you for subscribing. Let's see what's going on here. We are still on a little bit of a commercial break. Appreciate you subscribing. Appreciate you subscribing. Watch it tick up. Appreciate it. Hit the like button and subscribe. Our goal, we got to get to 38,000. We really got to get to 38,000 subscribers. Like, come on now. We are getting ready to get back to tip off as the watch party continues to grow. Uh, we got 41 people watching. It will grow as the show goes on and we get further into the game. What are you guys drinking? That's what I'm saying. Drop a like on my stream, man. Like, what the hell, man? Appreciate that. Just for that. Hey, when you said that, when you said drop a like on the stream, my AC kicked on too. I felt this like breeze coming through. I'm like, okay, okay. Got my AC rocking. I got this massive studio production. You guys will see we're expanding our platform. You guys will see that relatively soon. We're live every day, Monday through Friday. We have athletes coming on, NFL, NBA, MMA, UFC fighters, uh, also bare knuckle fighters, tattoo sponsor. Thank you for my tattoo sponsor. Appreciate it. Inkaholic down here in Miami. The game is back. Here we go. 23-23. You're doing exactly what you wanted to do offensively. Defensively, how would you assess what you've seen so far? Yeah, too deep on the drive. You know, three or four. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Plays at the rim. We got to do a game's going to start back up right now. Out, trying to get him into tougher twos. Appreciate it. All right, thank you. They are Appreciate holding it. UConn to 45% from the field. So this was the play here. Hurley reacting to Zach Eady's screen. Hurley was you see that candy officials. he's e like had a to like on, on the stream man huddle, and then hurley had something to say to him put where you guys are based at watching right now for the first time yeah it's a good screen, put where you're based at what state are you in here we go you come with the ball people like kicks it in the center goes off the glass and scores just like that easy 
and one and one. They took look, he's off the floor. You take him off the floor now, Klingon. Donovan Klingon is up there going, oh, I got a guy who's like six foot five now. No problem, six foot six. It's a seven foot four. That's the problem. Soon as he starts scoring points right now, they're gonna have to look back to the bench and bring their big man back on the court because he's not gonna be a couple. You can tell right now. Impossible. Smart set there to get clean going. Let's go, let's go. Like asking you Free to throw, go grant. bang, hits it. Right now, no, no. 26, 23, UConn. No we got number one in the East, we're number one in the West. On, on Hit the teams. like button and subscribe. Appreciate the subscribers, appreciate you guys. 37,781 people. The teardrop doesn't go. Uh, we got another subscriber. Thank you so much. I appreciate you guys. 37,782 subscribers. Appreciate you guys as we continue to grow. Hit the like button. I'm just, look, here's what I got to tell you right now. This is different than the college game from yesterday. This is different than the girls game. They're both, they're all talented. They're all talented. The difference with this is everyone on the court right now, like I told you, you got dinosaurs running around out here. I'm not saying it in a bad way. I'm saying dinosaurs out here that you can barely even cover. In the previous two games, Castle. He's in that second of the three. Oh, Edith's back in. Got rejected. Clean got the ball. Edith's back in the game. Party with the ball. Goes across half court. At the three-point line now. Be a three seconds. He has it left. Kicks it back. Pump fake. Drives the lane. He's gonna Goes up to the floater. The oh my God! Eden with the tip back. Eden with the tip back, the and the UConn coach yes, is going bananas, right bananas, bananas right now. The UConn coach is going bananas right now. If you're watching this, mute your TV and watch this. Here we go. Here we go. Initially by Klingon. Gets Caravan involved. Picks it back. Now it's Spencer Three point line. UConn. Oh, gets her low dribble. Flips it up. Ooh. It goes. How about that? Oh, it won't count. count it out. Foul what? called on the floor. They Spencer called the foul. The they I called the foul on Purdue. He wanted the bucket. He wanted the and one. The ref waved it off and said no. On that drop defense, that little foul line jumper. Appreciate you subscribing. Defensively in that drop coverage. That screen roll action or dribble handoff with the Appreciate bigs. you guys subscribing to the platform. Getting the watch party started. Called on Camden Heidi. Look at this. Look at this. Kick back. There's Klingon. Goes up clear, goes up, off the glass, Maybe and he hits the bucket. Donovan Klingon. I think he's got to be a factor on that Donovan Klingon. I, I, listen, I'm not going to lie. I've been saying Donovan Klingon. We're not going to say that on live. We'll say Klingon. We'll call him Klingon. 28-25, Huskies, we approach five minutes to 28, go. 28-25, here we go. Goes into Eden, in the paint, in the paint. He's going to go up. Oh, of course he's going to go up. Oh, good D, good D. Good defense. Good defense. That's one thing we're seeing in this finals. Yesterday's finals, Carolina against Iowa with the women's, and right now we're seeing defense, 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 and guess what? That wins championships, and that's what you're seeing right now. Mm. Love that. Yep. Both ends is he's tough. Oh, oh man, here comes you coming the ball across the half court. Ten, big ten player. Yes, Bert. Was that a block or a charge on the photographer? <laughs> here we go. This is it off back door. No, oh, goes up for the layup. Easy score. Thirty to twenty-five. Everybody lifted. When UConn doesn't get the ball, when, when, sorry, when Purdue doesn't get the ball to eat him. It's hard for them to score. 25. Newton now with nine points to lead the Huskies. It's a 9-2 run. Ooh, 9-2 run. Smith using the screen from Edie. Got the ball. Goes the in. Elbow. Oh. Cup and rim. Look at you. Pass the ball. Crowd. Off the glass. Rejected. Trying to do it with the offhand, and it's out of bounds. Last out of bounds, Purdue, Purdue ball. And the presence of Klingon right there. Wren indecisive down low. A little short on that hook shot. But, yeah, this pass right here. Dribble at the man. Great back. Worked on Listen. This. The misdirection, multiple options on this Appreciate offense. you guys subscribing to the platform as the watch party continues to grow. Jones Thank you guys. Gillis. Hit the like Check button and subscribe. And put a comment where you're from. You watch right now. Put where you're from in the chat. Well, they are bodies falling. Edie. Doesn't Edie. Go. No good. And the rebound controlled by Castle. He'll push the tempo. That is when they're tough. Picks it back. Three ball on. UConn goes for a deep range. Deep range. Misses on a three ball. Box out by Edie. The rim. Hesitated. Just a little bit. The traffic clear. 16 points. Five rebounds. Two blocks for Zach.
area. Here we go, here we go. Drive the lane, drive the lane. The move. Got a little body bump, and it's out of bounds off of Lawyer. Out of bounds off of Purdue. He drove the lane, went up. He drove the lane, went up, and literally got rejected, basically, but went off of him, so went out of bounds, and now nice. we have the ball for UConn to start it back as we come back after the commercial break. You know, I got commercial break, cool highlights, and things that pop up on the screen, but we're just rocking right through commercial breaks. That's what we're doing right now, rocking through commercial so breaks. All right. I appreciate you guys subscribing to the platform right now. 37,782 subscribers. I appreciate all you guys. If you're here for the first time, hit the like button and subscribe. You in here yesterday? Man. And who you guys got? Iowa? That'll wake you up, right? No, Iowa's not playing. Purdue or UConn? Put in the chat. Purdue or UConn if you have not yet. Oh, yeah. Like some subscribers candy all day. That's what we need. I remember the other day I was doing the live stream. I got started. I'm sitting here talking, telling the full thing going on and on. I'm like, no one's responding. Like, what the hell's going on? Chat was blank. People in there watching. I'm going... I'm telling people, put the like, hit the like button, do this, do that. All of a sudden, this random guy goes into, goes into the chat and he goes, uh, I think your volume's turned off. <laughs> I said, oh, shit. The damn soundboard wasn't even on. I was over here having a riot over here telling jokes and everything. And the guy's like, your volume's not on. I'm like, oh, yeah, I appreciate that. <laughs> Oh, yeah, now they're showing Caitlin Clark here. They're showing her on the screen. To rewrite history. You know what? For her to play so damn good, all-time leading scorer, and not, and then, you know, played against a South Carolina tough team, 37-0, was like, they're 37 up for a reason, dominated the game. Caitlin Clark didn't get a chance to walk out with a dub. But you know what? She had an excellent career. They're showing her right now live on the screen. State Farm is proud to excellent player. greatness. Here we go. We're back. We're back. We're back. The NCAA Men's National Championship game is sponsored by AT&T. Connecting changes everything. Acura. Precision crafted performance. Reese's you Peanut Butter Cutters. Appreciate you subscribing. By State Farm. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. Thirty to twenty-five, UConn. Gotta get lit. What are you guys drinking right now? In the battle of the pigs. Here we go. Gotta get deep Ready for the live game, play by play. He's got a touch, great determination. Need your TVs and listen to this. Give the live play by play. What's happening? Who's shooting? And who's scoring? At that basket, they keep guard, make them stump a little bit, maybe get some outside looks, and keep their motion going. 30, 25, UConn, 3.49 to go, first. You think back to a year ago when FDU beat Purdue, shocked the world. Here we go. One. Their philosophy was, hey, we'll let Zach Eady do all the work. We just can't let the other guys hurt us. And it worked. Well, it worked. Well, Zach Eady is doing all the work. Guys, the literally, seven Smith, foot four. Lawyer, Gillis, I'm calling him 10 foot four. He's 10 foot four from now on. In a tougher team this season. Number two in the country in three-point shooting. Here we go. Just behind UConn's Kentucky. got the ball. And UConn really now get a little motion. Three-point line. Usually quick spurts, screen slips. Drives the lane. Right it, has, it has been tough shot. Castle Tough shot. It's good. Goes. It's good. Drove the lane. It's both. good. Hit the like button. Subscribe. That is the first two of the night for the freshman from oh. Georgia. Stefan Castle. This is his job tonight right here. Contain. Who can five. cover someone seven foot four? Lead of the night seven wide open jumper for oh my god some move what a good move using that pump to oh no some move but that's his game right high percentage shots so step back hits the jumper like i am dan hurley during that timeout the pace of the game is ours keep playing fast like we want it wow. run eating make him tired constant wow. support for donovan clinging in the huddle you count with the ball in the paint runs the guy over Foul. foul. They called a charge. Stephon Castle, turnover, UConn. Ran out of room, really. And Jones put that foot on that Yeah, you're right, Kane. They play so damn good all season. That's a flop. Mm -hmm. The minute they have a little off game, people are like, what the hell's going on with Taylor Clark, right? Like, once again, not running their sets, trying to do a little bit there we go. too much. I'll tell you what, Taylor Clark can play in this damn game, and some of those yeah, Carolina girls can Jones play in this damn game, too. Not, I don't know why. 
This is the guy that makes great entry Here we go, passes. Purdue with the ball, three-point line. Purdue has taken one three-pointer in the subscriber. Thanks nice for subscribing. The screen as well. Tough match here, I think, for Caravan. Keep the dribble alive and go. It's gonna ISO him. Smith here we go, here we go, three-point line. High screen Steps eating. back. Smith's gonna take it. Bang! Oh, Hit that three ball, Purdue. Down by two. UConn leads 32 20. Timeout. UConn. To cut the UConn lead to two. And they call timeout. Timeout. Wow. Listen, the shots, the high percentage shots, and the high accuracy is what I'm talking about. Electrolytes are the leading sports drink. Packed with flavor and zero artificial. Do you guys have any tattoos? Anybody that's watching right now, do you guys have tattoos? Your team comes to work, <clears throat> gets started, and disappears into a hundred apps, each with their own. We are on a commercial break right now. Commercial break right now. Not a few hours. And it works for the As the people start climbing in, you know how it is in the first half. People are there, and then more people come in, and then we get the party started. No matter when you find it. Consider yourself lucky. Is it me? Is it me? Like during every game, and like it doesn't matter NBA, NFL, it doesn't matter what it is. It's like that first or second commercial is always a car commercial, and it's like this new car coming out. It's like car companies must be making so much damn money that they have so much commercial time, like so much TV and commercial time. You literally, as soon as you watch a game, they go to a commercial break. The first thing you see is oh, drive Toyota, boom, Ram truck, boom, get into a Hyundai. They got ten years. Warranty. Like they always have some kind of thing going on. It's like drive a Lexus. <laughs> like then you, I don't really see commercials for like Range Rover or like you don't see like a Lamborghini commercial. Like have you ever seen a Lamborghini commercial live on TV? Like boom, drive a Lambo, like drive a Huracan, drive an Aventador. Like I've never seen that. It's always been like Hyundai or Ford or drive a pickup truck. You know, Ford tough. Like like the, you see this all the time. You don't see anybody. You don't see Lambo commercials or like Ferrari commercials. Like I don't see any of that. We are seconds away from the game coming back on right now. And what are you guys drinking, man? I asked that question. Only got a few answers. Is anybody drinking in the game? Having popcorn? Like what are you eating during the game? It's commercial break. You can get up and grab a drink right now. Got about 20 seconds before the game is live again. Thank you. Appreciate you guys subscribing. Let's go back here and refresh that. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. All I'm saying right now is uh, if you're watching the game, literally if you're watching the game right now, and you feel you feel that UConn, like UConn doesn't belong or Purdue doesn't belong. After watching them play right now, it's like these teams are so damn good, so damn gifted. Like really gifted. Three-point shots are going down, high percentage. And as they shoot, you're like three ball, bang, good. Like when you go to NBA games and hitting those deep threes like that, shooting all the time, that's what these guys are doing right now. Here we go. The game is back on. Yesterday Let's get it started. With them and, uh, while somebody was relaxing by the pool. <laughs> Hit the like button, subscribe. You talked about you know, subscribe. He was mad at his performance. Agitated. Here we go. UConn with the ball. Three-point line. Here tonight. He was relaxing Getting ready to get started. Here we go. That's right. John Delane goes up with the floater. It's good. Just like that. Just like that. Out of the timeout. All season. Like just like that, scores. Bank on those things as a coaching staff. The, the only one thing I would say negative at the half court. Coach and relax. Purdue with the ball, down by four. Drive the lane, drive the lane. There he goes, drive the lane. Kicks it back Outside. to the center. Inside. Too deep. Up. What good defense, man! This defense, I'm telling you, this defense out of control. I haven't his defense like this in a while. Thanks for subscribing to the show. Appreciate it. Live play-by-play. -play. The defense is outrageous. I just put that in the chat right now. Got this damn shit right. I'm just telling you. 
The D, the D right now, that's the difference in this game and yesterday's game, too. The defense. Couldn't get it in cleanly, decides to take the timeout. Another freaking timeout? Got up by four, a minute 33 to play in the first half. A minute 33 to go in the first half. Okay, okay, getting closer to halftime. Do you, you know, if you're watching the game right now, literally, like, you come back, you're watching all these commercials, you got Burger King, you got Toyota, you got this, you got that. And then you have an All-State. All-State was there. You got this. And all of a sudden, they get on the court. You're like, let's go make some noise. Some right? Noise. Here we go. They get back to the game, and you're like, okay, let's play. Let's play. And they go timeout. You're like, dude, you just called a timeout like two seconds ago. Like, you didn't go over everything that you just – that was literally – you inbound the ball. It was like three seconds. Timeout again. You're like, they must have came out and did the shit completely wrong for you to call a quick timeout like that. But we're back at the tournament summary. Number one seeds meeting in the championship. Number one teams are playing the East and the West. Purdue and UConn. Featuring the Big Ten against the Big East. 14.4 average margin of victory this tournament. Second highest since the tournament expanded. Wow. To 64 teams. Purdue is trying to become the sixth Big Ten school to win a national championship. You hear it. You hear it. Is that Legend good? Did you hear that sound? Gene Cady is here. He also has legendary coach for Purdue is in the stands. The He's got a P on the back of his head. I don't know the tattoo or what that was, but. He's all in. That's something oh. Graf would do. Committed. Three ball rejected <laughs> by UConn. <laughs> UConn's got the ball coming up the court. <laughs> and you have a dollar sign. The Crossing half court. <laughs> How about that defense there by Carpenter? Here we go. My play by play. 34-30. UConn in front. At three point line. One minute to go in this first half. One minute to go in the first half. That's what they need. UConn with the ball. Newton's been excellent. Oh, nice kickball. Grabbed it. Jump ball. Jump ball. Jump ball. Jump ball. And that offense Dude, I'll tell you what. Precise from this UConn game is. We're accustomed to seeing. This is one of the best games I've seen in a long time in college arrow. basketball. They didn't, they didn't switch it from earlier. Yeah. Remember, Purdue had gotten it on the tie-up. Correct. Here we go. And even though Matt Painter That's is sound from the game, you hear it the loud and clear. The arrow is pointing in his direction. Jeffrey Anderson is handling it at the table. Yeah, they, he's explaining that. What are they? What are the, the refs? The other How do you guys feel about refs organized. nowadays? Yes. Like everyone so now is. This is correct. Everyone is hating on refs nowadays. Like are refs good or are refs doing too much? Roger Ayers just came over to confirm it. Good team player. They confirmed it. That guy. They Nine confirmed seconds it. Seconds left on the shot clock. Newton will toss it in. They use Kling at the screen. Gazidi's just inbound the ball. Up in there. You come with the ball at the three point line. Oh, Went for the three. Big it. man. Play nice again. Go for it again. Now it's Castle. One on one. He went for the three. Against freshman Colvin. Spencer is Take the it back. potato guy of this team. What do you need, coach? Got the lane. Slashes in. Woo. Oh, okay. Okay. UConn scores with the two. Basket four. That's a bucket. Yeah, with that left hand. Uh, That's a bucket. Purdue with the ball, coming to the court at three-point line. Look at the double. Oh, intercepted. Intercepted by UK. UConn's got the ball. And slows it down with 20 seconds. 22 seconds to go in the first half. Slows it down. Slows it down. Three, three seconds separation from the game clock. They've got a six-point advantage here. Here we go. Here we go. High screen. At the three-point line, high screen. Newton now with five to shoot. Spencer off the pin. Put it up, put it up, put it up. Spencer. Goes up. Steps in. Oh, oh rebound. Party with the ball goes down. One second to go. Tosses it. Oh, That's just missed the buzzer line. beater. Oh, End of the first half, 36 to 30. That was a hell of a first half. <laughs> That was an amazing ending to the first half. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. What more do you need to see, though, for the second half? I really like the pace of the game. I think the pace of the game right now probably favors us a little bit. Um, I think we're forcing them to play a little faster than they're used to. So hopefully Let's the coach has request. pace on them and wear them down late. Thank you. Good evening, right, Brenda. Tracy. Welcome. Newton with 11 to lead Welcome Newton. to the live play-by-play. It is now halftime. We're going to see some highlights here in a second. 36-30. Brandon, what are you drinking? There's people in the chat. We're scared to put Here's here. We're another drinking. tip from the tool shop. How to pick the right team. We got the boards cooking.
It is now halftime. I appreciate you guys joining the live. Halftime, halftime, halftime. People start coming back in. When these orange jeans go pop. All, all I'm saying is watching this game is so, it's so interesting to watch college players play this good, shoot this good, because that's how you look at people and go, this guy's going to the league for sure. And do you guys think Bronny James could play with these guys? Like, put a Y if you think yes or N for no. Because a lot of people are saying Bronny really doesn't have it. Now, I know LeBron does. He's got the genes, right? We know that. But Bryce, have you seen his younger brother? Bryce, the guy's sky is like 6'6". Six, six. I think Bronny's stuck at 6'2", six, 6'3". Six, but what will happen? Brent is on water. Okay. <clears throat> Nothing wrong with water. Water and popcorn. I, last time I had water and popcorn <laughs> was no good. I mean, I got to have like a popcorn. Popcorn is one of those things where you got to have a soda. Like popcorn and whatever else, it's got to be a soda or a beer or something. You, popcorn and water is like, man, this is just not working out. <laughs> That's just how I'm feeling. The hero it is halftime. We got a lot of commercials going on here. That was an interesting first half. I mean, that's all I can really say right now. Very interesting first half. It was constant, constant, constant feeding the big man down the center, Eden, from Purdue, and we knew that was going to happen, and he really is. They know it's going to happen. They know they're going to give him the ball. You can't stop it. you got to double cover, triple cover the guy, leave guys wide open out for, for the three-point shot, and that's why you can't do it. So when you get the ball to him, he's right next to the rim, puts his arm up, like literally puts his arm like this, and he's touching the rim. Just like that. Really simple. What's going to be the next big trend? My guess is searching millions of new and used... Where are you guys based in here right now for the people that are waiting for the game to come back on? Where are you guys based at? Target Circle Week is here. Get huge deals automatically by joining Target Circle for free. Does anybody even shop any like anything nowadays when you're buying anything is Amazon, right? Your Amazon, Target, Walmart, right? Is that like even back in the day it was like I'm going to Best Buy to get a TV. I'm going to, you know, Best Buy to get this electronic. Now I'm like, just go on Amazon, be here tomorrow morning. Like if you don't need it right now, go on there on Amazon, order it in the morning, you wake up, it's at your front door. Right? Like that's like what's happening right now. I don't think anybody even goes shopping anymore. All these Target commercials. Like, Target is one of those places, too. Like, you go to Target, and you buy anything. You're like, I'll go to Target. You leave there. You can get a couple items, and you leave. It's like two, $300. Like, what the hell did I just buy? Like, you can't even shop at Target, if you ask me. I just think it's overpriced. There's good stuff in there, I'm sure. And, yeah, it's halftime right now. Um, but Target is crazy. It is halftime, halftime, halftime. We'll get started here in a minute. Purdue left the back door open right there, and UConn took advantage. Halftime, halftime, halftime. Got 11 points in the first Hear what they got to say. Got a good one going. 36 to 30 is the UConn lead over Purdue. First time the Boilermakers. Candy, you shop at Target? In the tournament. Welcome, everybody. at and at the half. Yeah, I don't got Going shopping anymore is a disaster. here, Kenny the Judge Smith, and... Charles Barkley. You can get anything on Amazon nowadays too. Like as we talk you see some on TV, you're like, I want to get I want to get those headphones going on Amazon. It's like prime. Boom, tomorrow morning set your front door. Anything you want on Amazon nowadays. You don't want to leave those shooters open for Purdue. They've only they've only attempted. I gotta tell you, Purdue can shoot, so can UConn. 36 to 30 at halftime. Well played half of basketball. Charles Barkley's up here talking. Where is Shaquille O'Neal? He gonna get his number. But I'm not going to let those other three-point shooters get going. Hey, they, they got to get turn the AC on in here. They did make one adjustment. They bought Seth in the game. In they Miami, it's like sometimes. some but breeze. Like Klingon play him one-on-one. -on -one. That's where I would play. He's a great player. But, man, what a really fundamentally well Charles played. Barkley is sitting and there. And got his forehead shining. Even Dan Hurley admitted in his interview. There's a lot of foreheads shining up on the podium right now. Everybody's talking. It's got everybody talking on the podium right now has a forehead shining. When I say shining, there's one guy on the podium of all four. One guy's got hair, and Shaquille O'Neal's not even up there. If he was up there, it'd be five people up there with their forehead, whole head shining. 
second left. So even when he gets one, it's at about 10 to 12 feet. Next time again, look look at him laying on his left shoulder. So this game is interesting, I gotta tell you. I'm going with UConn. I'm going with UConn. But you know what? I really like what I really like what Purdy is doing. I really like what Purdy is doing, getting it to the guy. They got a main guy in the center. If they cover him though, they got to get on in the physical gameplay. They're showing some of the clips, the clips right now. But if you look on here, if you watch, new subscriber. Thanks for subscribing to the platform. Thirty-seven thousand seven hundred eighty-one people. Thank you for joining our show. We are in halftime right now, getting ready to get started for the second half. Oh my God! Everybody's forehead. I'm. I swear to God. Now. I'm not saying there's anything wrong with having your head shaved, but it's like everybody on the. I'm, I'm gonna have to go shave my head. Take a look and see how I would look with the head shave. I don't know if I could do the head shave. I gotta keep. I might gotta keep my look like this. The head shave might be crazy. Second half's about to kick up right now in gear. Thanks for subscribing to the platform. We are live every day at 10 o'clock and also play by plays we do for all the big time games. I cannot wait. I'll tell you right now, who loves the NFL in here? If you're watching right now, you're watching the game, you're watching the live play by play. Do you watch the NFL? Like, do you prefer the NFL or do you prefer basketball? Like, NFL or NBA? I, listen, I'm just saying, I love, love, love watching games like this. And I love watching the playoff basketball NBA. I love watching all that. But I'm an NFL guy all day long, especially during the season. I'm going NFL all day. But, but for the sake of what we got right now on TV, because NFL's not going on, live play-by-play, -play, college basketball, NBA, hockey's going on, baseball's going on. But come football season, I'm telling you right now, there's going to be thousands of people in here watching their football season. It's going to be a lot of fun. We're getting ready to get started. Back into the second half. And every single basket, if you watch basketball, is it me or is every time they go down the court, it's a screen? Like they're calling for a screen every time. The center comes running out, or the forward comes running out, calls the screen. You go back, back door to the center for the jam, back door for the forward for a layup, or fake it and go up for the layup. Like it's like everybody's running the same damn play. The percentage right now, forty-six percent Purdue is shooting. We're getting ready to get started again. Thirty-six thirty. I'm telling Braden Smith, and I'm telling. I'm ready for the second half. Can you just, all the bald guys on the podium right now with the shiny foreheads, turn off this, and let's get the players started. I'm NFL all day. I'm not going to lie. NFL all day. We have to get threes. And Zach Eady's got to keep scoring. <laughs> Defensively, we've got to be prepared out of a lot I got all kinds of cool clips on here, guys. Danny Hurley's run a play that scored. And don't forget Coming this. Timeout, don't forget this. After timeout, hit that and like button. As I told you, hit over 100 likes, $100 giveaway. Over 100 people in the live Xbox giveaway. Give the other super chat. I'll take a shot, gain 1,000 subscribers. I'll give $1,000 away. $100 super chat, and I will bong a beer. And that bong a beer, we will make Mike do that. And a fast break. They did a fantastic job of but I gotta tell you, the hit the like button, 100 likes. The first half, but we do a $100 giveaway for random, court. lucky person. Charles Barkley is swaying up there. They, that's all the way get he got that sport coat on, button up shirt, and tie. I'd walk around with a fan on in Miami. He's more of an up and down guy. And he's not just a standstill shooter. He's not even in the game offensively. And I agree with you, Chuck. You got to go for it. Everyone right now is sitting at their house right now, waiting for it to start. I'll be sipping on some kind of adult beverage. 
more pace so you can won't get use them until our sponsors give us some sponsors for the show <laughs> start announcing them live reason why it's so hot in here is because I got all these lights all these monitors computer screen computer screen computer screen computer screen just four screens in here laptop also have another Apple thing here all kinds of devices on stream decks live Run up the electric bill for the game, eh? Run up the electric bill. Make some noise! There we go. Get ready for the second half. Jalen, what are you wearing? What? <laughs> this is my tournament jacket. With AT&T, I can watch at home or on the go. There we go. Here we go. New subscriber. Getting ready to get started. Getting ready to get started. What? I'm just like Jalen. Uh, you got the air on in Virginia. Is the air on outside too? The it cooled down a little bit. For years, we are getting ready to get started with the second half. But every four years, bang, they take on the world. They represent our schools. Cannot wait. For the game to start back up. In our country. Only moments away from the start. Olympians are made here. Aquaman commercial. Like Aquaman? Willy Wonka in the Chocolate Factory? Barbie? On Max. Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. <laughs> I got to see that movie. Man. That was a good freaking movie, though, right? Like, everybody watched Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. Oh, yeah. The sponsors have reached out countless times <clears throat> ready for us <clears throat> to get me on their platforms to do stuff. We're building this. We're going to get our own drink out there. Create our own freaking drink. Spots our own show. There we go. We welcome you back, at and at the half. Getting into the paint and seeing Zach Eady. Yes. The solar eclipse was actually just Zach Eady standing up. The solar eclipse was just Zach Eady standing up. They just... <laughs> I said it. The solar eclipse <clears throat> was Zach Eady, the center of Purdue, just standing up in the way of the... <laughs> of the <laughs> it, it doesn't happen often. Hey, we've all seen darkness before. Stop it. No, not, a, not in the daylight. No, no. Come on, man. Come on, Chuck Strickland. I hate on the eclipse. Come on, Yo, stop listen. It. I saw a loser standing watching your blimp. How about that? <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen Chuck's blimp? <laughs> <laughs> they are hating on Chuck's baldy. So, you, so you're not a fan. You're not a fan uh, of the Well, eclipse. I'm not going to sit outside like an idiot and wait on the Here we go. 36-30. Get ready for the start of the second half. Can I ask you a second? Did you ask your family to wait on your blimp outside? I was trying to get my grandson to watch. See, there it is. So what are we talking about? Hey, the eclipse gonna happen again. I ain't gonna Did anybody happen. see the eclipse outside? <laughs> Did anybody go out there and see it? Did anybody go out there for themselves and see it and see what was going on? Man, everybody's scared if you ask me. Go out there and see. Oh, a lot of things are gonna happen. I'm not gonna go out there then. No, go out there and see. Oh, maybe you should get some water and toilet paper. What the hell is that gonna do? Well, because people are getting scared. You go get some gas in your car. Oh my god, I'll start this. <laughs> Ready for the second half. The eclipse was crazy. Yeah, everybody said, don't look at it. Go get these glasses from the, from the, you know, the local. Oh, here we are. Look, commercial. Chevy Silverado. Like every commercial. Car commercial. Yeah, they were like, oh, yeah, right now you got the eclipse going on outside. Go outside. Take these glasses. Where'd you get those glasses at? Oh, I got them over here at the at the Shell gas station. How the hell did Shell gas station all of a sudden have all these glasses lined up? Like, everybody had all these glasses to sell. People are outside. You're walking down the street, you know, buy these glasses on the side of the highway. Like, who prescribed these? Who prescribed these? That's what I'm... <laughs> Make some Subscriber. Get ready for the game. Here we go. Appreciate you guys riding this out. Because we're getting ready to get started. 
They're showing an ice cream, Blue Bunny ice cream commercial right now. Like, I'm not going to lie, the twist cones, I might have to try that out. Here we go, here we go. Game time is about to get started. I got some pictures. I got these guys up on the screen, too. This guy's balling. This guy's balling. Let's show him some love. This guy's balling. Can't say he's not. Can't say he's not. Right? But here we go. Seven foot four is doing his thing. Can't lie. Cannot lie. Yes, and Max. There we go. And then there were four. Welcome Let's to Fandom get 101. Started. You think this year's tourney was intense watching from a small screen? Imagine Sweet next year's final four. When these guys stop talking and their bald heads aren't on the screen anymore and the game starts, we can get out here and start getting ready. Here we go. And just so you guys know, if I wanted to, if I wanted to, instead of sitting here rocking with you guys, if I wanted to get lazy out here, I could have easily just pulled one of these, right? I could have easily just pulled one of those, but I ain't doing that. Rock and line. Hit the like button, subscribe. 20 minutes of action subscriber. to determine who wins the national title. Appreciate you guys. Back to Arizona after this on TBS. We are getting ready to start the are second half right now. Us? If you haven't put who you were rooting for, do that now. Because we're about to get live back into it again. Can you kind of Purdue. Shot. As the second Can't half gets ready to get started. Who programmed you? I'll see you tomorrow. The future isn't scary. Not investing in it is. 100 innovative companies, one ETF. Before investing carefully, 36 fund investment objectives, risk, to 20. Purchase expenses and more in prospectus at Invesco.com. I mean to fight this war. How much do these commercials cost? Like your HBO's original House of the Dragon. Has anybody ever seen House of the Dragon? Like that's the commercials they're showing right now. House of the Dragon? Like I'm trying to watch House of the NCAA basketball game right now. Like can you put the game back on? To war then. Not gonna lie, that's a like a good that's a like a good movie. Dragon. <laughs> Streaming exclusively on Max. Oh my God, now they're showing cookies, cookies, ice cream, Belvita. Oh shit, I have those cookies actually in my house. Who's gonna win the game? You can Or Join Purdue. today at BJ's.com. There we go, games get back on. People start coming back in. Start getting the watch party live. And shout out again to my tattoo sponsor, thank you. Always try scoop before you run. Listen to me. Hot dog diet got me straight. They're giving these guys a super rest a right now. Like, what are you? What are they giving these guys? Ginger ale, Gatorade, Gator lights. I got to tell you, playing basketball, ginger hey, ale. Tim Howard. You would be fire right now on the side. On NBC Sports in ultra high definition with the 4K oh, plus add-on. Just go to your membership settings. YouTube TV. Today. Here we go. Right for free. Bang. Here's the stadium. We're back at it right now. National Championship back live. Here we go. We're in the arena. We're in the stadium. We're getting ready to get lit right now. The like button and subscribe. Appreciate it. Let's do it. Get more with Geico. And by Wendy's. The official Wendy's. Who likes it? Is it Wendy's, McDonald's, or Burger King? Like, what's better, Wendy's, McDonald's, or Burger King? 74,423 here at State Farm Stadium, third highest in NCAA championship Woo! history. Let's take a look at our Home Depot. First here we go. Points in the paint, UConn winning that category, getting some points from the bench. Ian Eagle, Grant Hill, Bill Raftery, Tracy Wolfson, Gene Steratore. We are back in the arena right game. now. Obviously, the big man that was get the headline started. going into this game. But the three point line has been a non factor for Purdue because you see the guys on the screen right there. Those two guys are the guys. Eden on the left, right there, at, and on the right, uh, Donovan Clinton. So Who cares about threes when you have these kind of bigs right away? Eden they are in the court. down below in the paint. Good defense, better offense, and then they alley Damn. 
Petey establishing himself early. I think really the nice adjustment. Mm -hmm. Kevin using Clint, moving him outside. Ready to go. I'm ready to go. I'd like to see him get more touches against Edie and Got off to the hot start. He was quiet over the final eight minutes of the first half. Seven of Here we go. We're getting started right now. They're on the court. Last fouls. minute things with the coaches. Remember, they went to refs are ready to go. Here's point. how the refs get started. And they start Johnson stretching. Picked up they start stretching. Two quickies. And Bernie, I think the big concern go, go. of Ampardu now is the spurt, as Clark Kellogg will look, spurtability. Yes. Uh, dangerous UConn on the offense. Spurtability. I haven't heard that. Spurtability. Coming out of the locker room. He just felt like towards the end of that first half, they weren't a There we go. Game time. And he said he's going to his left doing a good job, but he'd like was a to go long, to his right long court. Long halftime for basketball. To get some threes. He still wants them to drive Everybody get out of their the seats. Basket, but they're, they're not get a hot dog. Feet, kick it out and try and establish something beyond the arc. Three-point shooting, Tracy, similar we just go. mentioned in that first half. Limited to just one. They've been averaging 8.4 per game. Thanks for subscribing. So far, Edie, first 12 minutes, 14 points. 37,780 people, live sub count. Stretch, he scored Hit the like button, subscribe. Clinging, just the Second one half has started now. With the one foul, that's when Johnson came in. Purdue with the ball, bring up over so half Klingen court. Here we go. And I am Purdue not getting threes because UConn staying at home. Clinging playing straight up. And did a pretty good job They're going to go right minutes. back to the big man. Nice right to the big nice man. Look at the that wasn't even a foul. That wasn't even a foul. Klingon had his arm held, I thought. Yeah. That That's what I'm He's saying. Like, over the top on this duck in. That wasn't a foul. Lazy. He's got to get in here. Uh, the hook and hole. Got to get these, refs, on that one. these refs are getting paid a lot of money because they're working so hard out there. So that is the second foul on Klingon. Edie couldn't finish the left hand. Re rejected UConn with the ball. Bring it up the court. Here we go. Three-point line. Three-point line. Goes in the lane. Puts up the floater. Rebound by UConn. Takes it back to three-point line. Takes a long three. Bang! UConn just had a, just had a deep range shot. I'm talking out there. The Didn't even think about it either. Just put it up. To lead here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Guys in the chat. Here we go. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Let's get the watch party started. 39-30. Defense. 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 Hitting the deck, Jones to save it. Oh, foul. A foul was called on the floor. Foul. 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 Spencer. How about Jones diving for that ball? <laughs> They're out there, bodies Making all over the court. Effort, and then the ability to the three ball that he just shot was like got the rebound. High, he looked at it. Chance, Bang. Didn't even think about it. And then like, nice shot. Looking like a fumble right there, going for it. Fumble, it's like a fumble. We can't wait for football stay, season to start. Getting dirty. First foul on Cam Spencer, nine point lead for okay. UConn. Just three point line. In the second half. Now, this These is small guards are driving the lane like nothing. Got to get them down low. Oh, up to the jam. UConn with the ball comes up, three-point line. This is it off. Went for it again. Oh, he would hit that. UConn would have had a little emotional swing. Oh, here we go. Hurt with the ball, drive it down. Pump fake, goes up. Bang. Hits it. 39-32, UConn right now. And that was a smart shot fake right there by Wren. So Trey Kaufman ran okay, here we go. Ability around the rim. At the three-point line. You count with the ball up 39, 32, up seven. Points of the paint all tied up. A lot of ball movement. For UConn. Is there activity here? Put it up. Castle. Jumper. Jump shot. No good. Off the rim. The Purdue with the ball. Rebound. Bring it back up the court. Jones. Here we go. Crosses over half court. He's got to do that. Be an impact player on the glass. Smith shifting gears. Shifting gears. Smith. Put the jumper up. Out. Rebound on UConn, the bringing the ball back up. Here we go. The transition, D, they have been the transition back and forth. Up nice off the glass. Nice. Bang, and that's good. Oh! UConn is looking pretty strong, moving fast. Looks like they made some coaching adjustments. UConn made some serious coaching adjustments. Almost a 10 second call right there. They got a foul. On, oh, no. It's going the other way. Calvin uh -oh. trying to set up against Caravan. A little frustration. Uh, oh, down inside the box. That is where Offensive you've got to be concerned right now. For UConn's ball. Relax, get comfortable. Listen, go down by nine. You don't want to go down by double digits. UConn with the ball at 41-32. 
Who do you guys got now, UConn of Purdue? Purdue entered action, number two in the country in assists, 18.7 per game. They have four. There we tonight. go. Out three point line. You need not guard anybody. Go. Kicks it out. Newton lets Ooh. it fall. Rebound. Look at three ball. Rebound, Slinger. UConn. Knocks it to the outside. Great no foul. No foul. Right Guys on the ground. No foul. Right Drop down the lane. Oh, another guy on the ground. And it's a blocking foul. Ooh, foul on Purdue. What's that mean? That means UConn is going to the line to shoot to. Going to the line to shoot to. Here we go. What do you think? I'm going to go with the charge on it. I There we go. When he makes Castle makes the Euro, he makes the contact to me. That's an offensive foul. So Mike three on Lester Jones. is saying the refs are cheating. No are the refs <laughs> cheating, guys? Respond to Mike. Are together? the refs cheating? Are they are they going too crazy right now? The are they missing calls? Who, Mike, who are they cheating for? Heidi will check in who do you want Gillis. to win, Mike? Now, who do you want to win, Mike? And who are the refs cheating for? Fouls. He's joined by Kaufman Wren on the Purdue bench. Raph, you talked about UConn for Purdue. UConn turning the screws coming out at half. We just need to settle down. Get Appreciate subscribers. Offense, get the ball Hit the like TV. button. Subscribe for Mike. Of course, the stops defensively a must. The premise of the UConn program has been defensive rebounding. They there we go. Thrown, as we said, the, on the offensive end, they can put it together. Oh, and that was a ball don't lie situation based on Gene's. Here we go, here we go. Should have been offensive. Pick it out. Party with the ball. Feed it. Goes up. Oh my god. Woo! Just say the slam went down. Oh, I know. I can see your name, buddy. There early is daddy's boy. I can see your name on there. My eyes are bad though. I gotta squint and see. The jam was serious though. Shot. An electricity bolt through this crowd. Spencer. Oh, off rebound. the glass. Rebound Castle UConn. There. Can't get it on the, first the, the offensive rebounder for UConn right now. The and offensive rebounding right now is unreal. I'm just saying. To Castle. Good hustle. Mike said the refs are cheating. What do you guys think about that in the chat? His last six shots. High low. Look at them load up. Oh, he steps. Oh, no, he got one on the floor. So the foul will be called. Klingon upset. Klingon is upset, too. The slam was living up to his last day. He so went up with, to get the rebound, skied up, scooped the ball, and boom, <laughs> slammed it down. Went up, grabbed the ball, and bang, slammed it down. Oh, like he's that. keeping busy. Oh, very busy. So I'm just saying, look, if you're watching this game right now, now we're in a little bit of a commercial break, but I got to tell you the gameplay, the action packed, the people in the arena, not even just people in the arena, the people on the court are playing so fast, so strong, moving the ball up and down. And also the, the ball movement too, like looking for the wide open guy. This is a tough situation for a lot of these players in the NBA uh, finals. Now in the NCAA finals, it is a very tough situation to get wide open guys, wide open looks. And the center, man, the center, both centers, forwards, these guys are big. Like I told you, they're like dinosaurs out there on the court. To you. People trying to kill you. ESPN wants UConn to win, Mike said. I said, Mike, again, Mo. Mo, 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 Mo. You think ESPN wants them to win? Mm -hmm. Wow. Rated PG-13. Early to Kentucky anyways. Don't let me go. Candy, you don't think the refs are cheating out there? <laughs> <He's coming. laughs> I'm watching these commercials. Like, they're paying so much money for these commercials. I'm just saying. And they get on there, and you're looking at the commercial going, dude, we could have shot that right out back of my house. We could have made this commercial low budget. Just, you know what I mean? What the hell? Like, who made this commercial? McDonald's or Burger King? What do you guys like? McDonald's, Burger King, or Wendy's? I've got hit on the basketball court. Mark's going to hold you back. Movement leaves marks. You're not the bus, but it shouldn't. Degree ultra clear. Oh my God! Low blow, Mo. You're what are you saying? Watch. You don't think girls can watch it? Watch men's sports. 
Candy's on it right now, Mo. She's like, you know what? Because that's because Candy is rooting. Candy is rooting for uh, UConn. Mo is not having it. Mo's like, uh, no, Purdue. Get back, get back. Hey, Mo, all I'm saying is Caitlin Clark, Caitlin Clark could probably ball out this game. Here we go. We're it's back at it right now. To the madness with the House of Highlights fan cam powered by Let's, go. Let's get back at it. Good action early. We're getting people back and watching live again. It was a long halftime, but now people are coming back three. in. It's been a fun one here in the national championship. Here we go. It's been 55 years since Purdue has been in the national title game. UConn is trying to win consecutive this trophies. This is getting more. 10 minutes for Edie, no points, one rebound. And Klingon out of the game with three fouls, so expect the Klingon's team. out of the game with three fouls. Open opportunities. Now they got to do double teams now. They got to double team Edie. Oh, oh backcourt. Right through the hands of Heidi. A they literally took out UConn had to take out their star center because of foul trouble. Like I said from the beginning of the game, they're gonna have to foul, eating the stop him. Now the guy's in foul trouble. He's out. Now this is when Purdue has a chance to come back. This is where Purdue has a chance to battle back. UConn can bring this lead to double figures. And this is where they're gonna use Johnson screening. Just a zone in the back, and that's go. Missed it from the outside, rebound. Hey, Mo, you think Purdue will come back right now, oh, easily? Smith. Check in with Tracy. Matt Painter, during that timeout, we need to play physical. This is not the time to play soft. We can't get stops. We can't get the ball. We are going to keep feeding Man. it into Edie over and over. The fouls are building on that. Whoa. 45-34, UConn. Purdue with the ball, bring it back across half court. Let's see what happens here. Are they going to pull up and hit a three? I know they're feeling that. Down eight and down below. Up by 11 right now. Ooh, in a second. 15 minutes in a second. I knew he was going for the three ball. Didn't get it. Rebound. Purdue with the rebound. Foul. Wait a second. Foul on Edie. Foul on Edie. In there on... Spencer off the rebound action. Seven foot four. Again, Edie. The ability to sprint. Either he's he going to step it up or it's going to get two times. Just solid play. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Live in the chat right now. New subscribers. Appreciate you guys coming and let's get the watch party started. That is Here we go. UConn with the ball, bringing it up. Zach Edie. UConn leads it 45 to 34. Back in the second half. It's getting, Johnson, getting amped up out here. Busy. Getting amped up out here. Edie's going to have to make something coming out a little bit this year. You come with the ball. Cuts. Newton comes to the Goes ball. Goes up. Out of you, Bugay! Listen, UConn is electrifying right now. Like, they are electrifying. They're getting it down. They're moving the ball around, hitting alley oops, hitting jumpers, getting into the big man. Now, and they're playing, like, full-court press with these guys right now. Let's see what happens here. Purdue stuck in mud here. What are they doing right now? Said Purdue stuck in mud. Goes up. Oh, they had to foul the big man. They had to foul the big man. I just heard this for the first time. They said Purdue stuck in mud here. Like, stuck in mud. Mud. and rolls and finishes at the rim. But who's the catalyst? He's going to the free throw line. Where here we go, here we go, here we go. Three. At the foul line right now. Six straight tournament games with Eden. at least 20 points, 10 rebounds. First, First one. Player to do it Bang. Hits it. In March Madness history. 47-35. Jones back in. And Will he hit the second? The way that UConn is Will he hit the second? Team. I mean, Zach Edie may. If you're new in the chat right now, the like button, subscribe, like Pooh. You got UConn to Purdue. Tennessee. Don't no be scared really to Pooh. You got. Get going because of that pressure defensively on the. And don't be. And don't be worried. The game catch. is not out of out of reach. Help Johnson out. They got somebody stepping in early. Lane violation. Lane violation. He's going to shoot again. He missed a shot. Three to make Someone stepped in early. Now they get a chance to shoot it again. He knows Welcome the to teams the live. Catch it and go and try to away from it. And go away from it. Exactly. Appreciate you guys subscribing. First points in a thirty-seven thousand seven hundred eighty people. He, he hits a pair. it. Let's go. Let's get the party started. Hit the like you button and subscribe. Enjoy They're the live play-by-play. Play. Meet your TVs. Listen up. Movement. You come with the ball. Slips. 
And they, they run a screen every time. This is their motion. Balls up. Ooh. Not gonna lie, shot an air ball there. You can't shot an air ball right there. I'm not gonna lie. They, they, they're getting rebounds. The rebound. UConn with another rebound. They got Edie, I believe. Johnson's activity. This is what keeps Edie happening. Here. This it is, is what's keeping UConn really flying. The They're getting so many offensive rebounds. By Trey Young, featuring the basketball. So many offensive rebounds. With A-list guests and his unique perspective. My eyes are terrible. I gotta look down and see everything. Around the league. Download the Bleacher Report app now to watch. Now the speed of Johnson's. I can't be sure. I'm trying to see what's going on in the town. I can't read it. Put my foot on the size hundred. Three point. Johnson gets a moving screen. Four. That might be his four. All there. love, guys. All love. So, Samson Johnson. And again, back to four. four. Here we go. Here we go. And this is where Klingon is great on that particular screen. He never fouls. That's just a little inexperience. Negates that opportunity. All love. Back in. Playing with Mo three fouls. Candy. All love. Enjoy the game. Here we go. See if they play straight up now. Driving it off the glass. Gets oh, in and out. And they are going to count it. They, look like they counted it. He dunked it. He jammed it down. He jammed it down. The ball goes in the rim, bounces back out the rim, and they said, fuck it. Fuck it. They called it. They called it. Edie was about to go insane. He was about to go. He was about to go off on the ref. And that was a violation. That possession, though. He was going to go off on the ref. Really the there we go. Bring them up the court. Crossing the half court. You come with the ball. Who's betting on the game? Mo, are you betting on the game? Nine point game. Eating now with 20. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Two blocks. Subscriber. Way outside. Here we go. You come with the ball. Drives the lane. Picks it back. Three point. Drives lane again. Kicks it back again. No call. Goes up. Off the glass. And it's good. They are going, they are balling right now. Balling. He has some ticker in field. He's more than just a shooter. No. Nine I wonder who's betting on the game right now. Spencer. Here we go. Davidson, Welcome to the chat. Maryland. Live. Edie. There's the double. Ooh. They got a foul. But look at this move here. Just this. attack the big fella. Oh, that extension. I can't believe you need a shot. Like, went up and, and over bit, Eden, went around, there, hung in the air, waited for the B-man to come down and launch it up shooter, three sideways quarter. off the glass. But, man, he's just a basketball player. Fun to watch. Eden with the ball. Looking, looking for somebody to pass to. Can't find anybody to pass it to. So. Smith, swing it. Gillis. Oh, he goes down the paint. Goes Eden. up. Rimmy. No ropes. Oh, nice Ooh, they are playing. It is getting Mason heated out here on the court. It is getting heated. It is getting right physical the on the court. 100. percent as well. You can feel the energy. Spencer, just you can feel the energy. Has there. a nose for the ball right there. You know, Gillis is one of the Big best time. attacking the offensive glass. Let's go. Let's go. Welcome to the chat. The like button, subscribe. He had it before the we got it going on right now. Ref, he wants a piece of it. Even giveaway also. We had 100 people doing a live giveaway here. again. Right. Ball shooting. The only one on the floor. Spencer now has. Let's go. Bring the ball for half court. You come with the ball. Pulling up. And he said he He's going to shoot the jumper again. Badly, and he thinks that's the end. He's going to shoot the jumper again. He's brought to this team this year. Hand it off. Moving Spencer, around. Moving around. Screen clinging. The screen. Kicks it back. Screen. Paraben, the nice fake. Place. Back restart. Five to shoot. UConn's restarting. Trying to make it. Down the lane. Stop Goes up. Go. Newton long strike. Oh, my God. In. What he a freaking play. No. Yo, when I tell you, like, the big man of Eden is about to get tired. He's got to be getting tired because UConn is running crazy right now. They're it's up by a lot. Cushion for UConn. 13 points. Hey, it's not over yet. This happens out. a lot. Go to the rim right away there. Eating with the ball. Double team. Picks it out. Shoots. Three Pass ball. Corner, no good. UConn with the rebound. UConn with the rebound. Okay. UConn kicks they it out. Three ball. Caravan. Ooh, off, the, off the back boat. Off the rim. Spencer, they got a foul. It will be Spencer. But who's in there? It's him. It's him. He's everywhere. Oh. oh talking about one. <laughs> Tristan Newton. Takeover mode late in the shot clock. 51-38. 51-38. I got to tell you, man, this game's getting heated right now. The aggressiveness, the culture, the energy. 
the people that want to win, you can see the efforts and all the things that they've done to make this happen to get to the finals, to get to the NCAA finals, the East and the West. Number one from both had to get through each and every single game to get there. The tournament's not easy. Some teams getting knocked out early on, not getting a chance to make it to the finals. Now you're in the finals and it's big time centers. It's big time shooters. There's a lot of fouls happening. It's getting aggressive. The refs are getting involved. Are the refs, are they calling a lot of fouls? Are they calling the right fouls? What do you guys think? I mean, I'm seeing, I'm seeing a big time gameplay right now and big time shots. Three point shots going down too. UConn really is starting to pull away. UConn is really starting to pull away right now. Uh, if you're in here for the first time, who you got? UConn or Purdue. But all I got to tell you is right now, the highlights I got to pull up here too and watching these guys play. Seven foot four, Eden. Seven foot four, right from Purdue. He's just, literally, he's just getting tired. Like, don't get me wrong. Pass to him, arms up, put it in. His arms touch the rim. Just stand in here, touch the rim. But he's just getting tired. He's getting double teamed. They got to find someone else that's going to shoot, kick the ball out to him, and hit the three ball. That's what they got to look at right now for the comeback. They got to be able to get him to drive the lane, even with the ball. Big man, open up the three-point shot, dish it out for the shot. If not, a little harder to come back. Need some big time defense right here as we get ready to come back to the game live. Yeah, feels right. Looking forward to getting it back going. The crowd is going absolutely crazy. The student section's going crazy. And again, on our commercial break, a car commercial. Jeep. You're not going to see, like I said, Lamborghini. You're not going to see these crazy Range Rovers. You're not going to see Ferrari. You're going to see Jeep. You're going to see Hyundai. You're going to see Ford. You're going to see Ram. Like that, they got the money for the commercial budget, man. <laughs> During the Jeep celebration event, get the well, we're getting ready to get started Grand again. Cherokee, starting at we are getting ready to get MSRP. started again. Visit Jeep.com for details. We are only 11 minutes ago in a second. Miles rewards credit card saves us 5% on the things we need. 5% off, 5% off, 5%. I don't know what you guys think, but this game's getting physical. For the things we want. Oh, we want this. We all getting ready to kick back off program. and get started again. You have to join, earn, and save today. Managing money can be a total mystery, especially when you juggle student life. That's why I found a game changer. Hunter, what's going on there, buddy? What's going on? Welcome. An average of 13 points instantly for free. Join me and You got to line up on this game? Is Purdue going to make a comeback? Starting Thursday, watch Masters Live. Is Purdue? Say what's up to Hunter. Welcome, Hunter, to Welcome, Hunter, to the conversation. Welcome, Hunter, to the chat. I want to take this moment to recognize our boss, CBS Sports Chairman Sean McManus, who is retiring next week after the match. Like button and subscribe. Sean has overseen every Final Four Let's since go. 1997. We wish him the best. We wouldn't be here without him and this incredible partnership with TNT Sports. Sean, thank you for everything that it you It is going to get wild here, uh, obviously, well in the last few minutes of the game. The college sports and it's going to get interesting, I promise you that. The Masters. And fouls are going to start kicking in here. here so many fouls are going to start happening. Oh, I didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> he shot an air ball. Ooh, Eden, an air listen, ball Eden just shot an air ball uh, a on his free throw. An air ball. Opportunity there oh, my God. For Purdue on the Down throw. by 13. You shot an air ball at the foul line. Here we go. Stalling. You can try to get it. For it. The effort by Smith and he saves okay, he didn't get the ball. Come to the court. Three point line. Guy on the court. Guy still on the ground. Not getting up. Shows it. Bounces. He got the ball down the paint. Goes up. Off the glass. Foul and one. And one. And one. He's got to make up for that free throw that he just shot that air ball. He better switch this. This better be, this better be a good foul shot. Because after that damn air ball, there's some bitch. Who's there? That's going to be all over memes tomorrow. You're going to see a meme tomorrow, definitely. With him going up, down by 13. Puts up the air ball at the foul line. Not good. Oh, they didn't, they didn't give it to him. In the half. They've turned it over Down 13. Tonight, just four assists. UConn Nine with the ball. Like At the three-point line. Right? <laughs> <laughs> special. Kicks back. Runs the screen. Three-point line. Draw, drives the, the lane. Drives. Goes up. Castle. Air ball. UConn with the ball again. Shot Shoots it up. Missed the jumper. Nice Rebounding. Here comes Pardue going up the court. Down 13. 10 minutes and 20 seconds ago. In the second. Got to get to light it up Go up. Oh, no. foul on Diara. Number four. Number wow. Two. That was savvy right there. Smith kind of initiated the Great action. Bird. Excuse me. Through his arms. 
Into DR right there, but maybe this will get him going. An air ball at Nothing the foul line is wild. I'm just saying. Purdue, give credit to the defense. I'm just saying. In the finals. Man, Castle has been terrific oh. on Smith. Braden Smith Braden at the foul Smith, line for Purdue. Mr. Hits the first one. Down by 12. This kid's moxie. Here we go, here we go. <laughs> There's only 10 minutes to go in this game. 10 minutes, 20 seconds to go in the game. Yes, you have come along. Down by 12. Because you see, like, he's going to beat you this He hits this and be down by 11. fight you. He's a quintessential player. Bang, hits it. Down by 11. This game's not out of reach. A couple buckets right here by Purdue, and the game is right back in. So, watch. Stay on your seats. Listen to the cast right now. I'll tell you exactly what's going on. At the three-point line right now, UConn with the ball. If they sink another shot, it's going to take some wind out of the sails. Oh, I thought he was going to pull it up. Goes the lane, kicks it back. Three-point shot. I thought he was going to pull it up again. Gets the screen. UConn dishes it in. Three-point line again for the shot. Three ball. Bang! It's another three ball. UConn is on fire for the three. That is what's making it happen. Moving the ball around. Unselfish gameplay. Unselfish ball movement is making this happen. Candy, you did say it. Lawyer takes it in. Good defense. Off the, ooh, off the back of the backboard. You come with the ball, breaks out, fast break, goes up and hits it again. Let's go. UConn is running away with this right now. If you look at Connecticut right now, if you look at Connecticut's back home base, they're showing the clips. They're showing a whole bunch of fans back in Connecticut going absolutely bananas right now. They're showing UConn fans going absolutely bananas back in their home state in Connecticut. And I know why. The three ball is raining right now. The three ball is raining. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. A little commercial break right now about to come back on in a second. But all I'm saying is this game is lit. This game is live. And my boy Eden hit from the foul line shot a air ball. I mean, that hurt. <laughs> that air ball the foul line. I'm not laughing at him. He's playing a great game. But that definitely hurt uh, the momentum. It hurt the swag. Down 16 with nine minutes to go. It's time to start looking at the ball. Move it to some threes. Obviously, twos are okay. There, there's some foul trouble. Twos are okay. We're getting ready to get back into the game right now. Hope you guys are excited to finish out today's show. Nine minutes ago. What do you guys think? Will there be a comeback? Do you think Purdue has a chance to come back? We're getting ready to get started again here. Despite what they just showed a commercial from Amazon Prime. Now that is. Use here we go. We are getting ready to get back to it live. Subscribe. Hit the like button and subscribe. 37,780 people. Appreciate you guys watching. Hit the like button and subscribe. It is going to run up here. I can't wait to see the end of this game right now. UConn, it's well-deserved. They have great players. They're moving the ball around. It's unselfish game, but like kicking the ball around left and right. You're seeing guys keep moving, keep moving. They're running screens, picking rolls, making plays, backdoor passes, and they're making – he didn't get tired. He can't cover everybody. He's playing in the center. He's a big man. But UConn is taking advantage of that, hitting the three-pointers as I see him down low, just draining threes. And that's been the separation right now in the second. It's been, it's been the three-ball separation. Three balls. Wow, I can't believe, I can't believe right now how the end of this game is rocking right now. We're getting ready to get back into it. I'm excited to see what happens at the end of the game. Timmy already got beat ups go. Yeah, Timmy already got beat up. Hit the like button and subscribe. The watch party will grow as we get further into the rest of the game. Buffalo Wild Wings, these commercials, maybe they know what they're doing. How to build there goes, there goes Shaquille O'Neal at Home Depot. <laughs> Drilling, painting. Oh, sweet. Want to give it a try? Shaquille O'Neal, literally, I mean, the guy, no wonder he's not on the cast right now, all the bald heads shining bald, because he's in the, all these damn commercials at Home Depot. Want more basketball? Here we are, back out of the game's on right now. Siri. Here we go. The coach has the most college basketball championships. Here we go. Uh, guys are on the court, ready for the end of this rock here. Family of 40 to 56, nine minutes, 27 seconds to go in the second. New Jersey high school state titles, Bobby Hurley. I cannot wait to see what happens here. Here we go. 
Champion as a head coach last year with inbound the ball. Like the Raptory family, they're everywhere. <laughs> there goes Purdue. <laughs> well, on my block, baby. They, they, they had to have some kind of conversation. The they had some kind of conversation right there. And they go over half court. The they got to have to shoot. Uh, uh, Julie said, Oh, down low. Out. Off the glass. Bang! Hits it down low. He has to establish himself. There we go. Here we go. Here we go. Really been affected. Okay, Purdue. Okay. What are you going to do? They had some conversation. They go and get in there. Get it to my boy down below. Let him go off the glass. They did it right away. That was their first field goal in four minutes of action. First points in four minutes they just scored. Purdue, first minutes in four minutes. Ooh, first points in four minutes. Here, those foul difficulties. Three point line, UConn with the ball. Good without it as well. He keeps busy. They're passing around the three point line. Run the screen. Run the screen. Wide open for the three. Bang! And another one! Yo, he's literally on fire. That's that, that pick, that little screen play, and they kick it back. Screen, you think he's going to do a little pick and roll, comes back and dishes it to the three point line of the three. They ran this so many times today. So many times. They could just take up, jump the off the rebound. UConn. Ref to him, grab the ball, head up the court right now, moving the ball, pace is going fast. There you go. They run that same play and hit that same damn thing again. Purdue better call timeout. Kicks it back, three point line. Oh, he went up there. He went up again for the three. Oh, whoa, in and out of the rim. In and out. In and out. In and out. Colvin, the catch, tough angle. They're letting that play keep going over and over again. We are under eight minutes to play. Here we go. They got a piece. Oh, foul. And that's number four on Donovan Klingon. Number four on Donovan Klingon. That's a big deal. That's a big freaking deal. Listen to what I'm saying right now. It's a big deal. We had a total eclipse. Don't look up, Dan. <laughs> Put the air on him. Many generations Ooh, ago, time. Caesar was our leader. Apes and humans lived side by side. Impossible as that may seem. Look, all I'm telling you right now, all I'm telling you right now is foul trouble. Foul trouble. Foul trouble. Klingon's got foul trouble right now. That's for sure. Well, you're, listen, as the game gets ready to kick back on again, when you're in foul trouble, you got four fouls, I believe, whatever it is, and you still got seven minutes to go. I'm just saying the big man's going to get some points on the board, but down 17, down 17, and a lot of people are like, I'm turning the game off. I get it. I get it. A lot of people are turning the game off because you think that your team is going to lose that damn fast. But watch till the end. Be a real fan and watch what happens. You never freaking know what's going on here. I think she just really wants a reset. Last commercial. Get ready to head back into the game. I got to tell you, it's not about the yesterday's God, game with Iowa fight. was just Iowa South Carolina was just so freaking impressive. Anytime. Yeah, those baby. girls were shooting. After South Carolina was so athletic, man, so athletic. These international putting it back on the starting line. They commercial right now. He's got to run the track. He's got no legs, or should I say, from the knees down or so. Marathon is for Achilles and showing wow. people that disabilities don't have. We are getting ready to get started for the rest of the game. It is 59-52, UConn, Purdue. Foul trouble, though. We got some foul trouble. New subscriber. Appreciate you subscribing. Ooh, it's hot. Does Purdue have a chance to come back? Does Purdue have a chance to come back? When you're down 17, like what? Are, what are you telling? What are you telling your players right now on the side? Hey, look, we're down 17, right? We're down 17. We got to run this. They're running the same pick and roll, fake pick and roll screen. They're gonna dish it back. They don't pass it. Hit the three point shot, and it's good. They keep running the same damn play. What are you telling your team right now? What is Purdue telling their team right now? You can't be saying much more than, hey, we got to ball out. We got to get focused. There we go. Field one of Bang, here we go. We're back at it. Point territory in the game. Ian Eagle, Grant Hill, Bill Raftery, Tracy wow. Wolfson, Gene Steratore, our producer Mark Wolf, director Mark Grant. There's just an air of invincibility right now with this. Husky here we go. Team. Here we go. Here we go. Guys, watch for the first time. Like button, subscribe. Defensively, 
can take it to another level. Frustrated I'm just the saying, national player UConn of the year. has been balling out. And really, Dan Hurley, you talked about the identity of this team. We're seeing it on display on the defensive end. The identity of UConn, yeah. Obviously, if he, no, if he up a, well, Dan Hurley has just I was going to say, if he didn't do another air ball. Notice? Not a lot of complaining. Yeah, to the just got into 59 43. You think Bob Hurley Sr. texted him at halftime? Being a man that led the nation. Mo is not happy about them. <laughs> He's given a lot of credit to his wife, Andrea, for balancing Here we go. him out, recognizing that he needed that in his life. Nice little change of Double the team. at the press. UConn moves the ball fast. Ahead. Fast break, goes up. Ooh, Ooh go. didn't get it. Why not catch it and finish it? Yeah. Don't, don't, don't act like so the game's over. It's not. For UConn with four fouls. Smith, feed it. Oh, eat it with a quick bucket. Eat it with a quick bucket. Let's not get sloppy. I mean, oh, Let's not get sloppy if you're UConn. 59-46. 7, seven uh, 15 to go. Here we go. Here we go. Move the court. UConn with the ball. So the lead is 13 for UConn. Driving. We are going to hit the seven-minute mark of the second half. Johnson, the cutter. Jams it. What a slip. So, no! UConn, UConn is literally on fire right now. I'm just saying, with Klingon on the bench, we just keep him on the bench right now. Keep him on the bench at least for a few more minutes. 46 Huskies. Who's a UConn fan here right now? Out of bounds. Out of bounds. UConn ball. They are. They want this W right now. They want this national championship. I can tell you right now. UConn is lit right now. He's an extension of Dan Hurley. Very similar to Dan Hurley. With Guys tying his shoes right now, ready for the W. UConn is not playing. Competitive, <laughs> competitive language. Never he did. Let's go. Here we go. Oh, foul. Is called for the foul on Castle. Foul. This summer, the Targaryens, the Iron Throne, and the biggest show Welcome on TV. Welcome to the live again, back. guys. Here we go, getting HBO started. Original series, Rockin' House of the 61, Dragon. 61, 46, UConn. Only UConn is doing the damn thing, I'm not going to lie. Danny blames With Spencer clinging on the bench. for some of his excitement. <laughs> it's a spillover effect. Oh, oh, is that back court? Oh, they didn't even call it. Spencer was hey. over the lawn. Spencer was over and back. Purdue fan section reacted. Eddie, Eddie, Eddie. Nice Spencer. If Spencer jams Not after going back court. Plenty of time on the shot clock. Here we go. Here we go with the ball. The crafty UConn. Castle at that Three point line. Pulls up. Uh, shoots it. Newton, the shake off and the jumper doesn't go. Nice the shake off just missed it. Offensive rebound. Reset. You can get the ball. Resetting. The resetting. So smart. Resetting on the clock down. Six minutes to go. In the second, 61 46. Does Purdue have a chance? Does Purdue have a chance right now? Uh oh. Until you slip and fall. Bang! No! UConn, I'm not gonna lie. UConn, UConn is just right now is just balling. They just come at you And it's hard as you get closer in the game. It gets hard. It gets so hard though to keep playing when you get beat like that. 63, 46 with five, 40 to go. To lawyer, they need buckets. They need buckets. Not kidding. Rebound foul call. Fifth one. They need buckets to drop. Now, buckets drop get it on. fast. A crowd there on the interior. Johnson Bang. playing with four fouls, and that is the quota. Yeah, I thought it was him. All right, all right, all right. Clinton's still on the bench. You have to give him credit. He's come in and played well. His energy, his speed. Mm -hmm. And that's Samson, the, of the second half. Johnson Clinton went out. Really gave him a lift with his activity out there and use this here, here we go here we go yeah, here Johnson, we go he doesn't, doesn't want to leave out. he doesn't want to come out i wouldn't want to come out either he, he fouled out know, in the commercial we're talking about nobody fronts 80. And I, a here lot we of go. coaches are out there probably say high school hey look hey 6 3 46 there's still five minutes on the guy i've seen crazy well, things happen up, but right now uconn so is just out looking out legit they are looking out legit he's an immovable object out there on the floor Subscribe. Appreciate you subscribing. So now UConn is going to go very We go small. live every day. They're at the foul line right now. Guys, we go live every single day, Monday through Friday. Hit the like button, subscribe, hit the notification bell. We go live every single morning at 10 o'clock. We do all live sports and entertainment. Live, live people on our show. Check it out. 
Follow us on Instagram. Send me a direct message. I will follow you. Uh, follow me. I'll follow you back. Send me a message. I'm right there on Instagram. Check it out, Brandon Mason Show. This also could present problems for Purdue on the offensive end. Edie having UConn, to go on UConn, 63. Zone, zone up, though, I think, don't you? Yeah, well, he will, but I mean. How will they finish this out right now? Eden, what a, what a great player. We'll have a great clearing it. A great career in the NBA. Sure. Purdue has not shown the ability to Inbound the ball. UConn, UConn with the ball. And without Double stops, covering. Full court press. Pass it up. Moving the ball fast. Spencer. Three-point line. Newton. They're slowing it, it down. There. Smart, it's smart it's game play right now by UConn to slow the ball down. Well, the body but, hey, only five minutes, 20 seconds to go. There's the blur screen, set up, screen, rescreen. Screen after screen after screen after screen. screen, after screen. The line at the three-point shot, Spencer. they keep doing it all game. Stops, pops. Bam! No! Spencer just hit a bucket, a jump, a right past the foul line. Great shot, great shot. High percentage shot for this guy, too. There we go. 18-point lead. 65. 49. Oops. Bang. He did scores. Carapan actually Good had shot. a point, though. Good he shot. He took a pop he's, he's on that a, move from Edie, who now has 29. He's going to need a facial tomorrow. Let's go. How do you guard this guy? It's hard to guard please. this guy. Mom, come help me. Oh, he said, please, Mom, come help me. Like, oh, <laughs> my God. Defense. Defense. We're going to be here a while. Well, UConn's looking like... Yeah. Looking like they got this they one in the bag. My game is on point. But we'll see what happens. Here goes the commercials again. And listen, the new game comes out. PlayStation, I don't know who, who's on here right now. Like, you got PlayStation, you got Xbox, you play the games. Do you play NCAA? Because they're coming out with a new game this year, NCAA football. Well, actually, it's next year. They kept on saying it's coming out, it's coming out, now it's coming. Do you play NCAA basketball? Do you play NCAA football when it was out? That oh, was fun back in the day. Presented by Buick, EJ, and the guys will have post-game analysis. Here we go right now. And back at it immediately. One shining Quick commercial break that was. All coming up. Most, Most points, points in a single, single tournament, 169. Zach Eady has just passed Elvin Hayes. Now behind Zach Eady Glenn is Rice third on the list. All-time scored in NCAA tournaments. Only two people ahead of him. Man and he's been so dominant this tournament still. A quiet third all-time. Uh, they have not got here we go here we go the others right. inbound the ball well, UConn again, with the ball inbound key point. up 65 up to 49 not that much time left but they're moving look the ball fast the here we go they're slowing it down now they're slowing it down they're bringing the ball to court and they're smart they get where they can drive the lane they get back let me waste about 20 more seconds three ball oh my god why'd he even shoot that he had like 20, 15 seconds to go on the play on the shot clock should sat down and just relax party with the ball driving the lane Heidi gets it over to big man Eden goes up Missed it. Ooh, missed it off the rim. Rebounded by Dion. Now UConn's got the ball. Are they going to walk it That's down, slow it down, too. win this game? Is UConn going to be the national champion? Looking like it right now. Appreciate you guys in the live. Hit the like button. Subscribe. 65-49. It's looking strong UConn right now. UConn with four minutes to go. That bird they use, Carabin, the they're they're, they're D-ing them up, but they're not fouling them. Drop defense. Newton Drives the lane, steps back. Down to three. Newton steps oh, fouled. The foul he drew the foul on Edie. Was that a three ball or was that two? Free throws coming up. My Chance God. to repeat for the team from Storrs, Connecticut. UConn, in UConn the seat. Listen, UConn has just been this powerful team for a long time. People that are watching this right now, you got to you got to understand what I'm saying. Like UConn has been on the map. UConn, Kentucky, Kansas, right? Duke, like they're the main, they're the powerhouse basketball teams. Like there's a few more, but UConn, Duke, uh Kansas, uh Kentucky, and uh, there's a few other like I said out there, but this is what you're seeing right now. You're seeing a very experienced organization you're seeing coaches that are experienced you're seeing people out there going we're used to this we're used to this stage used to this platform and Purdue's doing pretty damn good they just they're hanging with a team in UConn UConn's one of the best damn teams there is obviously for a reason they both came in with great records but it just looks like UConn is running away I mean they're hitting all those three balls and that same screen when you watch basketball I swear to God they're running a screen 24-7 you bring the ball up 
This guy's running the screen. This guy's running the screen. <laughs> right at the same play. Screen. Instead of running the pick and roll, they dish it back to a guy for a three-point shot. And they kept hitting it over and over and over. And that's one of the things they're going to see tomorrow. The coach is going to look at that film and go, oh, my God, why do we do that? They might want to switch up how they're running the defense right now. 65 to 49. I appreciate you guys. Appreciate hitting the like button and subscribe. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I look forward to talking to you guys, communicating with you guys. Put a like button. But also comment in the chat if you're in here for the first time. What city are you in? We are getting lower and lower into the game here. Three minutes and 50 seconds ago left in the play-by-play. -play. I'll tell you exactly what's going on here. A very wealthy Last commercial as we get ready to get back right back into the game. My name's Abigail. We're keeping wow. you here until your father gives us some money. I'm sorry about what's going on. These commercials happen. are out of control. Abigail. Anybody want to see that movie, Abigail? Coming out April 19th. Scary horror movie. Wow. In theaters, April 19th. Abigail. You might want to go see that. If you like scary movies, that looks like one of them. Here we go. Game is back yeah, on live. Here we go. Men's National Championship game is sponsored by Capital Subscribers. Appreciate subscribing. Your wallet? The Fall Guy. 37,780 people. All State. You're in good hands. And by. Coke's yeah, can you kind is going strong is for sure. The best they really are. Ever? There's really no chance right now. Right now, let's take a look at the no comeback coming. Rewarding performance. Well, a lot of it's been in the paint for UConn, not shooting great from the three, but attacking going at Edie. No comeback coming. High percentage shots downhill. It's been multiple guys. UConn Huskies, in 40 points in the paint tonight. UConn's got 40 points in the paint. Dan Hurley has preached. They spread it. There's no easy out either. They, they, they played the right way. They do. And, and if you come here we go, here we go. End of the game. Our, and I got some highlights to pull up. You will see the celebration of whoever wins the game. Looks like UConn right now is pulled away 65 49 with three minutes and 50 seconds ago. They were tested. At the foul line, in that game. to put more points on the board, and UConn. Seconds, and that doesn't sound like a lot of time. For UConn, that's an eternity. <laughs> Unaccustomed. There we go. Of course, Gino had a great Bang. run, too, where we this year. These three-point shots, though, were money all game. I got to tell you, hats off to UConn for that hitting those three-point buckets, pulling up, and he's raining them. alive and well up in Huskyville. MVP, their chain Last MVP chant back back for Tristan Newton. 17 points tonight. Duke. This man, Grant Hill. A part of that squad. Here we go. Buckets. This doesn't happen often. Hit another one. Hit another one. How they've done it. I mean, here we go. Here we go. Closest, as you said, that four minutes, forty seconds to go. Game. Clock ticking. Now, Eighteen with less than. Purdue drives late. Now they're feeling. They're feeling the pressure now. They're oh, hard foul on the ground. It's going to ends up on the ground. When you fall on the ground, the basketball court, and you skin that elbow. Holy shit! You know when you skin that elbow or skin that arm. It was does the not same feel good. Team does not feel good. Back. Well, same with us in, in the early 90s. This guy this just went down and slid across the court, and you heard the skin like, eh, like oh, shit. Guys I know that hurt. Roles, new players, and listen, system, next time we go live play by play, we got the whole NFL season. I will live every day at 10 o'clock. Make sure you come in here and put, really hit the notification bell. Get in here and put who you want for the win from the beginning. It's really been quite extraordinary. The same coach. Appreciate you guys watching live. No defensive principles, all about offense to catch up with his defense. Bang. What I love what he talked to us yesterday one. was how he adjusted the offense. 67 to, to 50. It's not about a system. It's a little far out of reach, a little bit now, obviously. Figuring out what works and mounts the ball. Players. And it's worked masterfully. And Purdue off air. Oh, God, they're playing. I got to tell you, really Purdue is like playing Krzyzewski. through the whistle. They're yeah. not slowing down. Yeah. They're, they're losing, game. but they're not that. slowing down. Well, I mean, technically, Duke, you know, didn't win until. <laughs> <laughs> the crowd is getting their money's worth. Coach, don't let Raph come between us, okay? <laughs> Beat up. Straight, Inbound the ball. Wins. Purdue with the ball. Gets the Edens. Takes back three-point line. They're shooting threes for sure now. They're shooting threes now for sure. They're going for threes. Screen, screen, Jones screen, three point shot. Feed it to Gillis. Oh, down low, They're down low. Big man goes off the glass two. for two. They have to go to the orthodontist. <laughs> this is over. But hey, guys, Purdue, they made 10 three pointers Saturday night. They made one. Oh, he's not staying at home. Here we go. Here we go. You cover the ball. Three point line. Uh, hold it. Hold it. Hold the ball. Let the clock tick down. What is the point of the rush? He has worked to a tee. 
Edie gets his. Nobody else does major damage. Here we go. The crowd is starting to feel it now. Uh, a warning. Yeah, Danny went out of the coach's box there. They gave a warning to the coach. Said you came in. They just gave a warning to the coach with three minutes, two minutes and 50 seconds to go, whatever, in the game. Like, warning to the coach for out of the coach's box. He thought he was in practice. He was on the court. They just showed replays on the court. So we're dead. 6752. Three ball rejected. Blocked by Spencer. Spencer's balling out there right now. Jones penetrates. Oh, nice lane. Nice lane. Jones lane put it up. Matt Painter. Spencer is balling. 13 4 game. 2 46 to Wow. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Need to be at your best? Listen, you if you're watching this for the first time, we we're, I cannot wait. I do all NFL all, all the time, all NFL updates, Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. Get on there and watch. All the guests come on the show, too. NFL, NBA, MMA, UFC, bare knuckle fighting. It's going to be great. But listen, now we're doing basketball because it's what's going on right now. Live play-by-play. -play. It's our only our second live play-by-play. -play. We're going to do it every single week with all the major games, and I cannot wait for the NFL season. So if you're a big-time NFL guy, you better hit the like button, subscribe. I'll have players come on the show to do play-by-play -play with me. Right now, other side of the screen right there where it says sub count you're going to see an nfl guy there whoever is going to be a player sitting there joining me live during the game it's going to be a lot of fun bullshitting and talking but all i'm saying right now is oh my god what is going on did uconn just nah, blow the brakes off of that i mean literally just came by and boom boom yeah. three 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 yes. three really hard to stop really hard to win a game when the other team's hitting three balls like that and Eden, Eden, man, seven foot four. I, I got to tell you, I was like seven foot four, hard to stop. Hey, all I'm saying is UConn, they just play tough. Klingon has been playing great. Number 32, Klingon, great player. Wow, can't stand up on him. Playing D against guys seven foot four. Here we go. Back on. They've actually improved See what they do. Any changes this year? And they got a speed team in here for defense. 67, careless, 54. Step the two minutes ago. Cut. Uh, two minutes in uh, 40 seconds. And screen as well. And watch the trap. If you're Inbound UConn. the ball. UConn with the ball. Up by 13. Foul. Oh, nickel dimer here. This is Smith. where all of a sudden. Of a foul two minutes. Newton. And that's tough. Purdue three minutes turns into trap. 10 minutes. <laughs> Right, like, and you're like, all right, I get it, I get it. Is it worth the last thing, Matt Payne? Is it worth that 67.54? On that inbound, maybe right now. Yeah, With two minutes and 40 seconds ago, well. two minutes and 14, it's worth it. Matt Painter in his 19th year as the head coach at Purdue. He went to Purdue. Okay. Two minutes for two minutes 44. Worked under Rush. Gene Cady, took over the head it's worth it right now. Job. Some fouls. Has done now 14. A tremendous job with this program. Finally getting to the final four. So validation there. Advancing to the national championship game. Bang. And right Hit now it. they're in a big hole. They there are. We, go. We, we were talking before the game just how 68 54. The will the Yukon Huskies be? Guys locally. Now 69-54. Well, the UConn Huskies be obviously went that the out national champion. Last year, but Looking like it right now. This team is regrouped. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Hit the like button. Subscribe. In position and Bang. Hit another one. Lance Jones of, of mm -hmm. a factor basis. Right. There we go. The, the Here's the court. Southern Illinois, the connection. Smith looking to drive in. 11 UConn fans on this roster are lit right now, Indiana. especially Connecticut. Oh, he jammed it down. He it down jammed it down. Klingon. And Klingon couldn't do anything. Four fouls right there. 33 points, nine rebounds. You might as well just. Eady. But you would go to Toronto. UConn, for come up the court. Here we go. State for somebody like that. Yeah, I think so. I cannot There's wait to hear the crowd. I have a loud one here for you guys to hear what it sounds like. He was not a heralded recruit. Not a recruit. Right there, Cam Spencer Big calling time player, a timeout, but went to the corner Where to call Dan, it. And I don't think Dan Hurley was pleased with that. Uh, but Edie told wow. us yesterday, I think you asked, where were you at the Final Four last year? Was it a B&B or B&B? Right? Yeah. You know what's crazy? Yeah. What's really crazy right now, a lot of people are going, oh, you guys are going to win. Yeah, I, I think so too. But here, at the end of the day, like if they hit two three-point, like two three-pointers, you're only down seven. I mean, like, that's how fast this this could turn around so fast. I don't think it's going to happen. I think UConn's going to win. But listen, they're only down 13. Two, three balls, you're down. You're down. I mean, that's not that bad. Two, three balls, you're down seven points. Two minutes to go in the game. 
They're not out of the game. They need to start hitting some threes. I'll tell you that right now. They need some three balls. AP Player of the Year, multiple award winners, Zach Giddy. He's got two out of Purdue. I mean, his improvement from, from day one. And look, he, he played at IMG. He Only one person ahead of him, Ralph Simpson. Here we go. How about that list, by the way? Those names, incredible. Impressive. This is looking, this is looking. Seven, four, they need, three, three, Purdue needs some three balls. Eady. I'll let you know if they do. But him and his the ref is now. By 13, with 214 to go. The ref is now on the coach going, you got to get back in the box. He blocks out the whole section. My lord. Will toss it in. Here we go. You can pass the ball in. They go to the back Two minutes and about five seconds to go in the game. 205. Drives the lane. This time for the three point shot. Drives the lane again. Cling in for two. Cling in for two. 71 to 58. 71 56. Yukon can taste it. Bang. Smith drives in. Couldn't finish. Boom. Slammed down by Edie. Sometimes you hear it on here, sometimes it's on there. On the here we go. Now be careful. A couple of mistakes. Kicks it back. Spencer ahead. Castle. Now they're running some of the clock. Fouled. Smith. 71 58. 130 to go. UConn can smell the championship right now. They can almost taste it. We saw him even on Saturday night play at the line tough, made for two. Work for everything. And defensively, the physicality, the taking that challenge. And Smith got off a this is just one of those games where early, UConn been just, I mean, the half, their ability, their, their skill gas. set. A lot like what South Carolina was with Iowa. Like, it was like, yeah, they had Caitlin Clark, but South Carolina had, like, five players on that team at all times that were just ballers. I mean, we, we saw him visit with him yesterday and surprised at his size. Wow. So when you look at this UConn game, if I asked you, Bang. who is the MVP tonight? I mean, everybody can well, see them in a nutshell, yeah. isn't it? Exactly. On the top of the screen, you're looking at it. Updates fast compared to YouTube TV. Spencer did his job. Jam down. Edie's got two more. Edie's got a she bunch of dunks down. in the game. Even on that possession, they're still guarding the three-point line. Oh, yeah. UConn. They don't care about the two. UConn with the ball, brings it in, goes across. Half court. Dish it off. Slowing it down. John a minute to go in the game. 73 to 60. Now here comes the crowd. The crowd. <laughs> here comes the crowd now. Run. The crowd is representing right fans now. On their feet behind head coach Dan Hurley. Shot clock down to four. Caravan float it. Should it cling in. And exclamation point with a land. Wow. Uh, that's typical of their approach. Here we go. Open, UConn is the run away. Three ball. Purdue air ball. Air ball. Woo. And now Dan Hurley is going to get the subs in. Here comes all the subs. They're putting all the subs in. And they're showing Connecticut stores. on the screen. All the fans back in, in Connecticut pumped up. Listen, all the love and support back home in Connecticut. People Those are, are pumped up. Let the party get started. The party's getting started for sure right now. He is one heck of a coach. With a talented group of unselfish players. What he has done 36 with seconds program. to go, about to inbound the ball. You're going to hear the, the crowd go ballistic. So differentiated themselves hear it from the other national championship teams in UConn with this back to back. But they went out there and got it done. They went out there and got it done. Impressive, incredible. Another guy from Seton Hall with an amazing pedigree <laughs> and insight UConn into this game. PJ will U. be <laughs> the <laughs> national <laughs> champ. Best point differential in tournament history. Mm. UConn. There we go. A dominant force. You're here to crowd, right? Hard work, Bird. Ross is in. So is Rumablu. Andrew Hurley is in. Along with wow. Solomon Ball. There they go. That's 23 seconds on the clock. Danny said, hold it. Matt said, no. You're going to hear him get loud in a minute. You're going to hear UConn get loud in a minute. Andrew Hurley is not going to run it. He's going to hold it. First time he's listened to Dan in years, huh? 
6.6 .6 on the clock. seconds to go on the clock. UConn is going to be your national champion. Shout out to UConn. Andrea Hurley. Shout out to all the people in Connecticut. Shout out to NCAA the basketball. The Hurley family. But wow. What an amazing run. It is a UConn coronation. Here they go. The Huskies, make Huskies win. They are the national champions. National champions. Congratulations to UConn. National champion 75 to 60. Uh, world class game. Obviously, sour faces Number of Purdue. Lives up not to looking billing. too excited. Purdue's not they happy. He didn't play. They still played a great game. They should 16. be very proud of themselves. They played phenomenal, but just not good enough to be UConn. I mean, UConn just had tons of stars, tons of great players, tons of great support, and they pulled it out. I, at the end of the day, this is a team that's been there, has done that. Um, and uh, like I said, very hard to watch. The Purdue faces walk off. It's college basketball. Remember, these guys are young. 19 years old, 20 years old, some are 18 years old. You know, if you're a freshman out there, can't forget the hard uh, love and sweat these guys put into this game. What was awesome. Yeah, can you see it? UConn pulled it out. What a great game to watch. Obviously, UConn pulled away convincingly. Wasn't like they had any trouble toward the end. Managed the game properly. Manage the ball. Basis. Moving the fast Sixth pace was something that Purdue just could not handle. Moving the, the ball around. And um, unfortunately, uh, Purdue came out on the lower end. But UConn, one of the best basketball clubs to watch. Great to watch. Very interesting. You have a feeling you have a lot left in Wow. He will be joining you someday in the Hall of Fame. What a game. I'm seeing people in the stands crying like guys in the student section like, Guys that really wanted them to win. His wife Andrea, his kids, one of his sons, Andrew what a game. on the team to experience it together. I appreciate all of you guys hanging with me today. Appreciate all the subscribers. Appreciate it. It's been great, obviously. Uh, more to come live play by play. I'll see you guys tomorrow, bright and early at 10 a.m. for a live show. But uh, it has been great. I look forward to more games this season. But keep in mind, we also have. I cannot wait for the NFL season. When that rolls around, we're doing live play-by-plays. That's when it's going to get real because obviously you guys know that is my super background it is the NFL. I look forward to seeing you guys soon live on the show, play-by-play -play for all the sports and events.